Yeah. 
Um, there's an overflow at the um, at the hall, and also there's a live stream for our service. So um, for younger. of Thai lava. You see it? You tell me now, let's talk to each other for a solo law. Well, let's go to the house. 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 Pulau Kelambi awal ya so. So se me ta to te fai ya ya vi i ai pea le swafo ye su So se me ta to te fai ya ya ma wo lu ngai pea lu na vi inga Wa so fa pe nei le fai ngo fie Wa so fa pe nei e fai ngata Ayah saya yang lalu leh, faham bersuah yang ayah yang lalu, matu cipak cahlo, faham matu faham lo, ia cuai lo, cuma malu malu tu payah, suh suh ayah faham ayah yang mula tu faham tua, yang faham lalu yang tu tuh faham lalu tua, lupa faham lalu ayah yang wah lalu tua malu faham lalu, suh faham Paulo. Mengapa yang malu ayah? Aing yang lalu. Apa yang faham? Aing yang wong bayar masani. 
O se e ma sandi on the tangi le telefoni ile lua tolu fa le vaveau o tei mi fa pena e ta tu tei loai se fa la ve la ve le ma alo fia ninety percent o le tei mi fa pena o se ta la fa no no. Na mawa le tala ile afia fio le aso duas full moleono. Ya, watu fesili le mafo fau ile loto. Ya, fa mau ni le tala. Ya, u fesili fo ile le tangate ile tua pe aisia. P.I.C.A. <laughs> Tato wab ai ile langi ele 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 uma le mamao le lo langi ma beo tumwai ya wana osina baenga ai fa fta ile lo fo le tua e ila wan e watato sila fa ile so le fusialo ya ai fa fta i wa amiel to ta si tu uwa le lao lao ma la sila si pa iem pa lo ma ngafa lo sa sa se ma nei David nga fa na wi la so luas luas fu mal luo fe pori a fe wi se la wi beto luas fu a so luas fu o yanwari a fe wi se la wi was fu mal to o o David only we o tama to ono O uso lao David ia fa salafa ti tu la ia fa salafa fa salafa stage stage stand please fa salafa Tom Nathan Patty and Philip ia uso lao David. Thank you. Eliasi matua e moi miti ya sofa pene. O atato fa nau o le luma na ile o atato aina. I au mai le vala au le tua ya tatu fa nau ya ona nu nu mi le ol ma fe fa ai fa fa yo lo so ifu le tua si li atu le si la fia le tua na ilo tato fa ma fa na fa na me fu le tua ilo loto ile ne ya so ma so lo tu toe o le ateli ilu ngol fu nga ile ile nei Nai la aso o te fatalo fatuai foi, ia inga ma wo o lo o mai mo mai lungo le live stream o fia lava le, ba inga lo langi o lo e sila sila ma mai bo mai ai 
Matu fatalo from Mato Fafilo yet to yet to do with the soul. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, family and friends. My name is Pese Foy, father of D.D. David Jonathan Pese. And David was born on the 20th of February. I better make this right. 20th of February, 1993. Brother to these guys that I just mentioned previously. On behalf of the Hene family and the Pesesia Opo family, I would like to welcome you all to Didi's family service. Also a warm welcome extended out to those that who watch or join us from overseas and local here in Aotearoa through live stream. When bad news received, it's a worse nightmare of a parent. If I say I'm okay, I'm lying. If I say I'm fine, I'm pretending. I'm lying, but that is because I want to be a tower of strength for the living. I pretend because I have to stand, to stay strong for the remaining boys and my family. Through the lenses of our children's eyes, it tells us that this world should be a better place. Life of this planet called Earth, it should be have no limit. Longevity of life, it should have no end. But unfortunately, that's not the case. Our children are not supposed to be our past. They are our present, our future, and they are our legacy. I believe this whole thing is wrong. This family service is wrong. What I mean It's because I should be in that coffin. And he should stand here talking about me. But then, unfortunately, I have no choice. And at the end of the day, it's God's choice. The Lord is my strength. He is my tower of refuge. He is my rock and my salvation. And whom shall I fear? This service gives families and friends the opportunity to celebrate 
29 years and nine months of our son Didi. Thank you once again. Thank you for your love and thank you for your kindness. And before I hand it over to um, Reverend, I would like to um, make some brief announcement. Um, for your information, that's our restroom there. And, the, uh, and on the right is the, um, uh, the bathroom. I haven't um, asked where is the, um, the uh, yeah, so uh, that, that's the um, exit there for any emergency. And I believe that we can all gather and assemble on somewhere out there. And also that one, that in case there is a, an emergency. Ya na unifasi islangel meolo ya ya tatu falele taua ya itu lea ilona itu tau matau ya afa pe foite ua ya isi fa arabi lave le malofia ya olo ya 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 faitu tu oa ya ulo tu ifafu ona tatu fa atistasi lei o le kapaka la isi tu ranga te ua di ali maise taimi ita wini alofo le tua tatu te amate ilon finengalo tatu fa i ilon finengalo ilia so Yola tu na tu lo ile sungal fa senga inga ya reverend eproni futi multato programi faftai Manato lewa, mai au na pailei, fa tau to voi langu tonu le nei fia fi mo na tu langa, ile sau noanga le feta lainga ya pese, ya ole sa matame ile nei fia fi, a ole afanga solo le tato fa moe moe, o te te talo atu malenga nga fa alo alo, se ia sila sila ne lau telefoni. In a year two, we may feel a little silent mode. Can I kindly ask all of us? Can you make sure that your phone is on silent mode so that it won't uh, ring while we are in the process of our service? Family Molly. Yeah, you don't have to turn it off. Just make sure it's on silent mode. Ole au tātou tāpua i le tua, i le sao ninga whāle a inga o le atali'i, i a Didi David Jonathan Bessie. A wā wo o mauti noa i le mawhai e le oti po le ola, po a ngelu po a li'i, po o mea yaso nei, po o mea yaso o lumanai, po o le maalosi, po o le maualunga, po o le loloto, po o se isi mea na whaia, E le ma whaia ia meo na whaatea i na mai tātou i le alofa o le atua o lo o ia keriso Iesu lo tātou wali'i. For I am certain that nothing can separate us from his love, neither death nor life, neither angels nor other heavenly rulers or powers, neither the present nor the future, neither the world above nor the world below. There is nothing in all creation that will ever be able to separate us from the love of God, which is ours through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Tato Tatalo. Wa poto poto matua ma inga wo ma e masani le nei fiafi. Wa e si le fia lo na fa moe moe. O mai mo mato loto ma fatia. Pe tai mato te le sa ili ina ya mala malama lo finangalo. A mato te sa ili le li ye lo pa i mai. E te whaa maafa na whanna ilo mato maafa tia. A o whaa ngā solo na nei whaa moe moe. I a i filo filo lo wanganga. I na i a i u mea uma ilo vi inga. A i a sili o na leo tele. Le fe awo le maanu maa loo. 
lo que hizo huía fa fa y ina le otti maletu nga mau a te tala ile ava no mo mato le o le fa va ulava o no lo sua fa yesu a te talo ai amen o le ata to pepese o le vin o le tu el luas el lau luas ful malelima luas el lau luas ful malelima le pese a ma e ale pese le ya on fa solo le o tato mo li mau after the him yeah, if you have the program, then we'll continue with our eulogies. Now, just a word of caution. We want to hear about Didi, not about you. Huh? Uh, don't worry about you. Someone else will do that for you. Tonight is about Didi, so make sure everything that we say is about him. Huh?
Hi everyone. I say my speech in Psalm 1, as I, I believe I'm the only Psalm 1 flow in Psalm 1 and all my brothers. <laughs> yeah, more more on more to lot of tightly. I'm the older one. I'm the only one who grew up in Samoa. Yeah. Never lie, ah, never shy. Did he? Came and got some money in New Zealand. Well, the first time in 1993, I was with my singer, or show. Kill him, my show sister. Ah. <laughs> I would never lie. She makes me proud, no doubt. So, a little life I did. Very, very unique. Honestly. Ngay kamo did. Kung yamako, all my brothers. I love all the son. Middle name now, little sister. Jonathan. Fainua e mokmakua. Lo, 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 son. E lo, sister. Onga, Pangalia, Paulia, Sekangakin. Epipi yellow onga. Onga is very unique. It's different but unique. For all of you guys, Didi, I say three words now and then I'm finished. Growing up with Didi, very, very tough, very loving, beautiful personality. Um, I'm lost for word. She's gone so early. And I'm, I'm so, so proud to call you my sister. It's an honor, Didi. Even though you borrow money from me, but hey. <laughs> you say I'll pay you tomorrow. But yes, never come through. <laughs> but that's our relationship, ah, my little sister. Hey, bro, if I am so much of a good thing as in my life, oh, yeah, so come, come. I'll pay you next week, ah. Huh? Yeah, okay, okay, come on. Never. Okay, I say goodbye to my money, then I say, so, yeah, that's how my relationship with my. My sister, so, so I will never, 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 ever forget that big smile of you, of her. Pride, pride, very unique, but I'm going to miss her so much. It's a shock, but through my kids, Diddy, fly high girl, love you, and always and always be in my heart. Fafta, I love you. Salafa, <laughs> I'm missing for him or all. Now, yeah, you touch a whistle at it, Tilly. Oh, Diddy, David, Jonathan, Bissy. You are, oh, yeah. Lela for a young Wakula of speech like Munimau. Pay out a light a Fasalafa. If I had it, Lela Fasamo. But, um, 
first and foremost, all praise to God for the strength for us to be present and well here today. As most of you would know, or knew Didi, he was a very outspoken, opinionated, and a very strong, spontaneous character. And I would like you guys to know that he got that from, from our dad. And of course, he had another gentle side of him. He was loving, caring, affectionate, which he got from our mother, of course. Wherever Didi would go, you know, he would laugh with people and joke around and that big smile of us I'll, I'll never forget. It would light up the room and even though I'd be so angry with him, for some reason I would laugh along with him, even though it would probably be at my expense. I remember vividly when David, well, when we brought David home back from the hospital when he was born, from Middlemore Hospital, we were making our way back home. And my dad was driving, our dad was driving, and I remember my dad asking the question, what name should we name, name baby? And I was waiting, paused a little while, waited for my siblings and my mum to come up with something. Obviously they took too long. So I just mentioned David. And without knowing, eventually that evening, afternoon, whatever it was, was evening, afternoon, mum and dad eventually named baby David Jonathan Bessie. And so as Didi grew up, obviously I, I got a partner and they got, got along really well. And one day they were sitting on, sitting on the porch at home in Manurewa, where my old lady lives right now. And I could overhear them talking about nicknames to, to name him. Yeah. And they had some hilarious names they were talking about. And um, obviously Didi, Didi stuck. And that's what most people know him today. <clears throat> the name David Jonathan Bissi, to me, is pretty powerful from the Bible itself. Being King David, in favour with Jesus, well, God, and then Jonathan, the son of King Saul, the previous king of Israel which both grew and um, bonded together like brothers, but they weren't. As our brother grew older, into his t early teens, he was going through that transitional period, that transitional phase in his life. My partner who isn't here today because she's actually attending her own family service, uh, her grandmother passed away and doing their family service as we speak. Yeah, they were very close and she wanted me to say a poem on her behalf. I had a long, long speech to talk about today, but I'm not going to take up too much time. So I'll skip to the poem. So this is what my partner wrote for Didi. Didi, this is never goodbye, near or far. You'll be remembered and always cherished in our hearts. The wind will blow, the sun may shine, rest to no memories of you will be a piece of my mind. <coughs> Gentle like a flower, brighter than a star. Go in peace, no longer with scars. God bless you, we praise, always. Love you always, Didi. Love from Sophie. 
the relationship between me and my younger sibling, Didi, was more a agree to disagree. <coughs> All for obvious reasons, being the second eldest and him being the youngest and spontaneous and I'm being boring and old. So yeah, we had our moments. But none of those moments would take away the love of a brother between each other. And uh, one thing I'll take away from Didi is I won't live life as much as he did, but I will try and enjoy life as much as he did. And greatly appreciate all the beautiful faces here today. And uh, if Didi was here, he would say cheer up and stop crying, mum. And um, yeah, I'll love and we'll have God bless. Falava. Um, I'd like to extend my gratitude uh, to all family and friends who have come tonight to honour the life of Didi David Jonathan Bessie. I can tell and see from the past days that Didi was loved, adored and cherished by so many, so thank you again for coming. I'd like to introduce myself and my uh, little family here, um, starting with my daughter Yasmin. I um, have my um, son here, Oscar, um, my other son, Caleb, is also being um, looked at, and then my beautiful partner here, Louisa. My name is uh, Natsan Yelu Siaopo Pese. I'm the uh, older, good-looking brother of Didi. Um, <laughs> so I left in New Zealand in 2006, when Didi was only 13. We had a gap of almost 10 years apart, okay. Um, not experiencing life together with Didi. During that time, Didi had achieved many things in school. For example, receiving a scholarship and a laptop as a prize, competing in the Bring It On dance show. I was shocked when I saw a YouTube clip of Didi's school Bring It On performance in 2010. I was very impressed and thought, yeah, I've seen my dad do those moves in Savai. <laughs> Coming back to New Zealand in 2015, I noticed Didi had become a strong and almost independent person, shifting out of a home to a cabin into the driveway, baby steps. All of us have known Didi in a variety of roles. A daughter, a sister, a cousin, an auntie, and a great friend. I have known Didi to be the following roles only to name a few. A financial controller. Didi would know exactly when we would receive our pay. <laughs> she would then call and check up to see if our financial status is okay. And if okay, all of a sudden, we would become instant finance. <laughs> I love it when I receive a phone call from my Didi. Once I see her caller ID appear on my phone as breaking news Didi, I answer it with a warm and welcoming no. She would say, I'm calling to check on the kids, and I would say no. But we all know the Bank of Mum will always be there to help Didi and us all, and that's a mum's love for the kids. A sibling's love is tough love, but meant for the right reasons. Number two, a doctor. Didi would never fall or fail in this area. For example, Didi would feel sick and know the best medicine for this is rest. And rest she did. No earthquake would wake Didi up from her health rest. Another example is when I needed um, help 
due to lack of numbers for an indoor netball team. I reached out to Didi and she brought quality help and they came, they saw and we conquered. Afterwards, you would need to hydrate and I'm sure hydrate she did. Third and last, a warehouse manager. Didi would always have your back as a warehouse manager. If one day you noticed something that had mysteriously disappeared in your room or the fridge, hand on heart, Didi would have it in her room, keeping it safe till the day you need it again or not. <clears throat> Didi is our baby of the family. When, when I heard of the news about our Didi, a lot of questions and strong emotions ran everywhere in my mind and body. I honestly cannot describe the pain I felt that time. I was lost. I was angry. I was confused. I honestly did not know who I was. I am a person they would, um, they would like to plan things. Louisa would call me um, Captain Planet. But this, I had no plan on how to approach it. Then I turned to this Bible app to try and find answers. Then I came across a plan called Grieving Well. And I started reading the daily devotion when I was in Melbourne, trying to get Didi back home. Straight from the get-go, the devotion said, when tragedy strikes, many might question whether or not God is good. When the Lord takes someone we love home suddenly, it might seem though as God is selfish. Then the devotion led to responding to that by saying, if you get rid of God, you've still got problems. There's still sickness and evil. Then I read about Jesus' question to Peter in John chapter 6, verse 67 to 68 in the devotion which says, will you leave me? And Peter's answer is, where would we go? You have the words of eternal life. If you've experienced God's goodness in the past during a difficult time, certainly that helps. He's able to handle your today and tomorrow. Didi, <clears throat> This is not a goodbye. As I've told my kids, this life is only temporary. I will see you when my time is caught upon. Say hello to Auntie Ina, Auntie Losa, Uncle Filippo, Auntie Sina, Nana to Ina, and especially the ones that raised you, Kukwa and La Sela. You will always be in our hearts, and we all love you, Didi. Now you can rest. That's I love it. Yala to Natule, Pesele, Hene family, Amulmore.
Ja, OT. Hat er noch was zu? Bei ihm am Malo, da zu einer war vier Männer. Hat er der wo mein Mann? Einen Lua. Wie ihr per langer Leo der Tour nicht so, da zu verdua ei. Langer Leo malo na lofa ei, da zu. Yeah, my Tonyo PC family. Yeah, most of us so we're in the same generation. Yo, my Tonyo Kausonga. Yeah, pay your own little mature grandchildren, Ashimatu Tina. They live on the Mavaya to run so far. Yeah, if you feel about my two face a piece. More more we night pale mass and more fear let you. And Missy the more night pale mass and funnel tattoo anger. Bullet for your love anger, yeah. David, D, Jonathan, Sha Opopis. You didn't hear fear. Ia luar ni mati upese, ada mati utang faya tuai, tapi ia ipl itu ni fiaf.
Talo for love is so Inga or Ingo Ana Rosa and I am David's aka Dee's second cousin. Uh, my mum is Sarona, she's standing at the back there and she's first cousins with Dee. Uh apologies, I'm gonna do my speech in um, English. So I thought I'd just start off with just listing a few things that I loved about Dee. Dee. Um <laughs> that's too early. Um, Didi, I loved your sense of humour. I would, I could always guarantee a good laugh with you. I loved how you loved family. You always made sure to message um, when you were coming to Wellington or if we came up here, you would get in contact and see what um, our plans were so you could come and catch up with us. Didi, I loved how you loved your mum. Everyone knew you were your mum's um, belly, her right hand. I know for sure she was the same for you. Uh, growing up, from what I can remember, Didi was always looking out for me. Didi took me under her wing, so to speak. Uh, she was always spoiling me, so all the boys, boy cousins would hang out and she'd come and grab me and be like, come, let's go do our own thing. So we'd go and chill. Um... A funny story about Didi. So I work for the police, don't judge me please. Um, but uh, we monitor all the jobs happening in the country. So on a night shift, I think it was two o'clock in the morning, I can't remember. But I was sitting there and a name came up that I knew obviously. It said David Bette on the board. And I was like, what the heck? So I called Didi and I called her on Facebook and I was like, cuz, is your car being stolen? And she's like, yeah, cuz, I just, it's too late, I've already, the car's already gone, it's already gone. And I was like, oh, uh, and she's like, can you find out where they are? So I was like, oh yeah, sweet, hung up, and then Didi called me back. She was like, cuz, can you tell me what my name, what my name is on the board? I was like, oh, it says um, David Bisson. She's like, oh, I've changed my name legally, everything, my gender, everything legally. I don't know why they're... So he, um, he was more angry at the fact that his name wasn't right on the board other than his car being stolen by Jewies. Um, but that was a funny story about Didi. Didi, I loved everything about you. Thank you for loving me the way you did. You messaged me not long before you um, passed asking if you could wear whatever you wanted to my wedding and I told you I didn't care what you wore as long as you showed up on the day to celebrate with me. Uh, you have been my biggest cheerleader since I can remember and I'm so blessed to have been a part of your life, Didi. Thank you for loving me. If there's one thing that I loved and I admired about oh, most about you, it would be that you stayed true to who you were and you were unapologetic about it. It's not easy growing up in a strong Samoan Christian family with the values that we live by. But my dear Didi, I am so blessed to know that those who were close to you loved and accepted you for you. You're gone too soon. You were meant to celebrate my special day in Feb. I love you, Didi. That's all that matters. Thank you, everyone. Sorry. <clears throat> um, hello, Talofa, to everyone, families and friends of our late beloved um, David Bese, also known as Didi. Greetings all in Jesus' name. Um, uh, what's it called? I'd just like to introduce myself. I'm Vaina or Trish. Uh, first cousin of Didi. I'm Didi's dad and my mom are siblings. I would like to extend my gratitude to each and every one of you that has come today to celebrate 
the life of our dear Didi. Special thanks to all families and friends that traveled all the way from Samoa and other parts of the world. Uh, not forgetting your whanau from Wellington. Acknowledge Didi's close friends. Oh yeah, sorry. And also um, Didi's close friends that helped with everything. Uh, before I begin, it will be unfair for me to compose sweet memories of Didi alone, uh, knowing that we all love and cared for her. With that, I will read our sweet memories of Didi that was written by our first cousins uh, in Australia and also here in Auckland. Um, yeah, okay. So first I'll just start with um, Tima's one. Uh, yeah, so... Tima um, wrote a beautiful poem um, for Didi, so just gonna have a read. Um, <clears throat> Dear Didi, you were one of the cousins that was the youngest in age, but showed us oldies how to see the sun more gracefully on stage. You had a gift of making people smile while always doing so dressed in style. You held yourself with such humility and grace while also being strong, firm, and fierce in your place. One memory around a bonfire and the conversation in that space, where you shared your wisdom, knowledge, and experience, which I will always embrace. You always had the best mocks, which always made us laugh. I wish we had more time to take just one last photograph. Sorry. Your memories will stay alive as you are now. With our maker, rest in love, my dear cousin, in God's heavenly acre. Okay, sorry. Um, and also Via's one, so uh, they are all um, Didi's first cousins as well, their dad and four uh, brothers. Uh, years in Australia, so she just moved to Melbourne where they were supposed to meet up with Didi. Um, to my beautiful cousin Didi, it was only last month I messaged you to let you know I was moving here and we were looking forward to catching up. I'm here now, cuz, in Melbourne. I've arrived a little while so away, so like you messaged me a few months ago asking if I was coming to Melbourne with a boy for his Kirikiki team Siva, you offered me your place to stay and you said and said you would love do a ipu for us because thank you for loving your family the way you did. So many memories together, cuz I will always remember our sneaky sickies together, me, you and Vaina. Oh god. <laughs> Sneaking off for a smoke at family events and at times having to hide. I don't know why, because we were in our twenties. <laughs> <laughs> your roast game was strong and your pose and beauty stronger. I don't think you were impressed at my format club royal that night. You were sober driver and Anna of Olitsa, I can't remember. I woke up with an injured ankle. Yeah. We will miss you at family gatherings. Your mocks, your laugh and your infectious smile. Rest now, Queen. Please give Nana a big hug and a kiss for me. I love you, my cuz, Emanuelo Malanga. Yeah, and um, and then Sarah's one, uh, Didi. From a young age, you were the mocha of us cousins, the one with the smart comebacks and always a guarantee, a guarantee, guaranteed laugh wherever we're all together. So many memories of you growing up. Remembering when you helped me organize my thirtieth birthday drinks. You came over with your laptop to organize the music and rolling your eyes at my choice of songs. Then on the night you almost had a misa with one of my friends because he kept asking you to play certain songs and you kept uh, and you kept saying no. That's the Didi I remember you to be straight up and fearless. You wanted to catch up when we were in Melbourne in October, but we're all leaving the next day, so we didn't get the chance. And I'm so sorry because. I wish so much that we did just to have that one last laugh with you. 
I've learned anything from your passing is that tomorrow is not promised and so we must make the most of today and cherish every moment with our loved ones. Please take care of my Christina up there, cuz. Give her and Nana a big hug for me. I will never forget the beautiful person you were. Love you, our cousin, Emanuelo Malanga. And Patsy's one from Australia. Um, Hi, Didi. My sisters have reflected and spoken truly beautifully of your presence in our lives and those you have touched. I did not get to know you as well as they did, but the times I do remember when we would get together for family events and you would always be right there with everyone, joking, smiling, laughing and playing. I wish we got the chance to see you in Melbourne when we were there a few months ago, but I know we will see each other again. <clears throat> To Uncle Foy, Auntie Sina, Auntie Mele, um, my cousins Masi, Nathan, and Philip, I wish I could be there. Could be there tonight, but I know our amazing God will give you the comfort and healing you seek at this time. I love you all and continue to have you in my prayers. Lastly, Didi, please say hi to Nana, Papa, Uncle Filippo. Auntie Losa, Auntie Sina, and I know you'll be making them laugh too in heaven, giving them the Christmas. Manuelo Malanga Didi, always and forever, and Pele and our kids. Yeah. Um, you know. So um, just, I just have um, too many memories, both the funny and the sad and the happy. Um, but it may take months, but it was still not done. However, I'm going to try as much as possible to make it short and sweet, <clears throat> like the others. Uh, Didi was many people in one person. Uh, he was my cousin, my friend, my sister, my strong brother, my boxing mate, my gym partner, and my partner in crime. <clears throat> The first time I met Didi, he was about one year old. When we would sit at the back of the car, he would be pinching me and try to pull my lashes. But funny, when we grew up, he has the perfect lashes. Um, the re my relationship with Didi never ceased, even after I got married. I remember one night Didi graduated from high school and came home and demanded, demanded Holo to sleep in the guest room while he sleeps with me and Jerry when my son was still little. Um, fast forward, by the time every year, uh, by this time every year, especially December, um, Didi would text um, and see if Nana still have teeth so that she can bring some pulingi home. Uh, so, since, so since both you and Nana left me, or left us, so you both can enjoy your pulingi up there in heaven. What I always admire about you, Didi, is that you just left your house and saw your mom, but once you arrive at my place, you would pick up the phone and call your mom that you're at Vaina's now and get to end your conversation always with saying, I love you, mom. I get to learn that um, this, that, uh, well, I get to learn from this is that tell your loved ones that you love them because time and death waits for no one, young or old. When I used to work in Manirewa, you would always tell me to come every morning on my way to work so you can fix my makeup and we can have breakfast together and that your mom getting us meccas. You knew how to get me there faster, but when getting there, you're still fast asleep. <laughs> uh, January this year, Didi asked me to be in a boot camp challenge with her to be in a duo challenge and only went to one box fit training with me and then messaged me that, um, that she's busy with work and most of the time you wouldn't be able to make it to training, but I kept going. So when you left, I felt like there was a reason why you took me there, <coughs> so that when you both, you and Nana Lee boot camp, was a place that was preparing me mentally. Um, my last flight on a plane with you was on a 26. Um, I told you that I was going to play touch rugby for the first time in my life on the 26. And so we both giggled and um, told each other that we're going to um, update each other after that. But you left us that very morning on the 26th, Didi. Um, it's very hard to summarize all these years, but uh, we will meet again on that glorious morning. And um, I did pray to God to please give me a sign 
you know, if Didi's okay, if our Didi's safe. And I did have a little um, flinch. I think it only took about three seconds, my dream, of our Nana. She was wearing black and gold. She was just facing the other side, looking surprised, you know, when she hadn't seen um, her her kids for a long time and someone walks in. Um, that was the exactly smile that I saw um, um, Nana giving on the other corner, which I cannot see what she's looking at. But yeah, I believe that's yeah, a bit jealous that she's our first cousin that made it to Nana without any of us. But yeah, um, to God be the glory forever and ever. Amen.
Ya, orang orang Lucia ni fasih lah. Ya, asyik orang. Asyik orang lalu ya tu celik si si lalu si bai ngol fadau ngak. Ya. Kalau lawa si nak mula mau pu pu foi. Orang orang le first class nak tiri le. Orang macam tua itu supat sama cak. Ya, otiri. Otiri eh saya umai tiri pokalah meo. Kalau Cina saya mua lempai nang alu. Eh, eno eno fua unyai matua eh, fai umai tiri, bili mai, kas, esau lo makua, tak? Seiloa, ayo ufalo ngu, fai melo Cina saya mua, lewo unyai onol pokalam ya tiri, tiri, fai cai lice lewo mewe fai eh. Ya cakap umur awal ingat, ya ayam saya, ya le eleven four eight ona malu waktu four isu macam tambah, nak pakai lelo kasih ingat apa isamu, lelo cuy lelo ngah mai tiri lelo lelo, atas tol, lelo silfie lelo cuy ingat luang sahaya ya, ya otiri four eight tol lelo macam awal ingat, so saya macam Tu nak air matu ay, ya, esina nafas ay, esina le cecullo, ce matu ay bang, ya ay, pokalah me umat cili le, le matu ay bang ay asom, cili, ya, ini mah fine lah ngaloi. Ini lah lofa, boi. Ona saa tau si fata si tau e, e na na la si na matuto, na beauty di, tai. Chalo falafia, chalo falafia. Ya, lava mai pele omu sai. E pe fai tu lau la omu ni mau. A fai na e su mai malo palang keke. Ya. E le na e su a tu lota wale ao mai ma. Get comfortable. Mo mua no o fa tu lo. E le ma malo. Well, I'm going to talk to you about my father and nephew. I'm going to talk to you about your father and nephew. I'm going to talk to you about my father and nephew. I'm going to talk to you about my father and nephew. I'm going to talk to you about my father and nephew. I'm going to talk to you about my father and nephew. Um, o siya o manamele tuwi la o tafa. Ya, ma siya o tamamatua le tuwi an o tafa. I am one of many of Didi's first cousins on mom's side. And uh, probably the closest to Didi. Uh, how dare you? How dare you leave me like this? Um, me and Didi, we grew up together. Um, you know, in the Samoan household, because when Didi was young, I tell you, so we would sneak um, when my parents fell asleep. Yeah, Wake up in the morning and my dad's reminding us, Yeah, and so that's how it was. Um, we have shared so many days and hours and minutes together and I'm so grateful to God for our relationship and our bond. 
Um, one thing about Didi that no one has mentioned yet. Only ka voli yet kalakalia. Anywhere face voli calls me up. King Hanga lo lo fell off, lo ko lo malo fanga. Every lima ya tidi so pick ya up. Pack ya up voli. I am a foot voli ya wo. I'd pick a king. Ya fear kill a tidi double waffle of cheese and extra mayo. Heaps of onions. That was her burger. And uh, Mecca's was definitely the boss combo. Oka okay. She loved her food, fast food. Loved it. Yeah, alu alu wanga training. Yeah, wa ya koko ay my foot the burger. The video calls me. Oh, what happened to your boot camp? Oh, I'll do it next week. I got hungry. La wo masi o sistema ko. Yeah, eo ala training. Kwa ay ko ya. Eh, masi Lucy. Not only gain, 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 no losing any weight. Oh, Didi. We would have some dance competitions, me and Didi. She showed me uh, Beyonce's dance, uh, Get Me Body. Yeah. She'll be like, so I will go, Get Me Body, and and then I, the other person will go like this. So it was a, Get Me Body. Get me body, and then get me body. This is what she taught me because uh, we we're getting ready for the clubs. <laughs> Sorry, Dad <laughs> and Mum. Um, yeah, so we were always prepared if we were at a dance competition. That was our our song. Get me body, get me body, get me body. Oh my gosh, Daddy, you were <coughs> one of a kind. And your love was so special to me. We shared so much time together, but still not enough. Nowhere near enough. O te loa. Walu tiri marafia fia. She lived a very, very spontaneous life, as you heard previously. And uh, she loved her brothers, her parents, but most importantly, she loved her mom. Mama's girl, this one. Avil my foot, Didi. Oh, I have some news to tell you. Okay, what happened? Yeah, la la my la 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 my la la my la la my la 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 Text me if you want to know the 101. Okay, I'm calling now. Find my little pokey or lea. Or lea mea, my lea mea. Oh no, oh no. I can never ever forget. And the last conversation we had before you suddenly left was that you're gonna call me back. And I waited. And you didn't call. And it was so weird that you didn't text when you get home from church, message me or call me. And I had no idea. But I'm so glad that we got to say I love you on our last call. Before you left. You will always hold a very special place in my heart. Your tuffy mala lo fai malanga. Tato toi fai loa e isi te mi. Thank you all of Taimoro to Sumai, to all of Didi's family and friends. I know some of you through Didi, you guys know some of us through her. She had so many friends. And uh, this is not even everyone. Not even everyone. Yeah, I bet in an FFE phone, I see the money mouth pool. Um I could go on for hours, but I know it only tato so nina. Yeah, always see for yourself fine man for fear I I wanna say my pair, mom my pair on the phone. Bit so funny to lao money mouth less so my you know my heart. You were my ride or die. And um, sometimes I would choose you over my husband. He knows. 
pe kau ai misa ya ya amanga o tiri o le voli o le voli ale perga ale perga whatever i thank you guys so much for listening to my mon mau and your fiafi of tai tai so ninga ya manu ya te le lava to e to la o le ta to a fiafi of tai My name is Rachel, and I am Didi's uh, younger first cousin from her Hene family. Although Didi is my first cousin, I always saw her as my big sister. <clears throat> I didn't see her any different. And I loved her for who she was or who she is. I admired her for that. She was comfortable in her own skin and she didn't care what anyone, what anyone would think about her. She was someone that inspired self-confidence for me always. She was a very confident person. She was always someone I looked forward to seeing every time we had family events. When I would come to the house here in Manu, um, in Iran at Haybridge, my first question would be, where's Dee Dee? I remember when I was younger and I had seen her journey as she transitioned or changed from a boy into a girl. And I had referred to her as he. I was about 11 and she was 14. We have a three years age gap. She turned to me and she goes, <clears throat> I'm a girl now. I'm your sister. Call me a she, not a he. From that day forward, she was no longer my brother, but my sister. I respected her wishes easily, and I, I, I adored her for that. When I look back at her journey, changing from a boy into a female, it wasn't easy. And I would say that if one word to describe it would be inspiring. She was so, so strong inside and out. She, had, she was headstrong. My relationship with Didi was very close. She was also very close with my mum, my beloved mum, Ina Hene. They hung out a lot. They would go to Halsey together. When we would go to, for walks with her friends too, that I see, that I hear. And I was always just their little shadow that followed them. Didi would also invite me to her events as I grew older. And I would meet all the beautiful queens just like her. And I loved that she shared that part of her life with me. And I got to see another side of her, her very true self. 
We all grew up together in, um, from nappies um, in Otara, in Zelda Ave, where we share very fond memories at our grandparents' house, our guardian angels, Totoa and La Sela. As I grew older, I grew very protective of Didi, and Didi has always been very protective of me. If you know me, you would know Didi. Didi was known by my friends, even by my in-laws, even my mum's family. Everyone knows who Didi is to me. Didi was also known as a instigator, a false kangaka. An example would be Sam and Philip, my cousin, oh, Philip, Philip and Sam's wedding. We had a hen's night, Samantha's hen's night, five years ago. And Didi had been the one who was giving out shots. Of course, I was the one who she gave them to, one of them. <coughs> we had been waiting for the party bus to arrive. And by that time, way before then, I was already gone. So the party bus arrived and Didi said to the bus driver, let's go to Royals. So we hopped into the bus and um, 10 minutes into the bus, I already started feeling sick, so motion sickness. And guess who came to my rescue? Didi. She knew she did. it was her fault. <laughs> she felt bad. She took me to the back of the bus, rested my head on her, and told me to sleep it off. As I lay on her, she goes in my ear, I told you not to drink those shots. And I just got up and gave the look. Another memory is when she met my partner. I was still in high school. And um, the very first time she met my partner just behind me here. After that, after she had met my partner, she goes, your boyfriend's hot. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and then the hot. Yeah. And she goes, Does he have any brothers, cousins? <laughs> or can I have him? <laughs> and I said, No. <laughs> I'm watching you. <laughs> That's Didi. She's always a joker. I don't know if she was joking with that one. But <laughs> oh, uh, Didi was a very beautiful, humble, kind, loving, a big hard person. She was quiet, she came across as quiet and reserved, but her actions always spoke louder than words. <laughs> As you can see, I'm the only tall one out of our, my Hene family. <laughs> we were both the sky towers in the family now, it's just me. <sighs> Growing up, Didi always told me to appreciate my body and love me for myself and always just have confidence in how I look. And I honestly <laughs> appreciate for that because I wouldn't be the confident person I am today. She spoke confidence into me every time she saw me. <sighs> Who will I turn to when it comes to planning our family events? Our last, our first time we planned together was our New Year's at Naranik Beach. We had them. We had so much fun that day, and we had, we couldn't stop messaging each other about it. 
how successful our day had um, gone for New Year's at Naranik Beach. We were looking forward to coming together for Mum's 65th, uh, 65th birthday in January, and after that, her, her big 30th in February, where I was looking forward to celebrating with her. Didi, since you have left, you, you have left a big hole in our family. Visits to Haybridge will never be the same. You're gone way too soon and it really sucks. Please say hi to our Grandma, Lysela, Grandpa, Kukua, and my mom. You know, you guys must be having a beautiful reunion together. I miss you so much. Your beautiful face. It's not goodbye. I'll see you later. Thank you.
Uh, we will keep our eulogies a break and we'll have our prayers now and afterwards yeah, we can continue with our eulogies. Tato Ivo Matitalo Ile Tua Le Tua Le Ola Ma Yesu Keriso Na Ia Fato Ilalo Le Oti Ma Matala Ile Ala Ile Ola Ifa Ava Vau Ma Le Fa Moe Moe Tu Mau Ola Ufa Tu Tua Ma To Atu Yo Luma Ile Ne Yaso Ma Loto Ma Fatia O No Se Ta Si Epele Yo Ma To Loto Ua E A Mia Ua mātou wong e upo e whaa mata layo mātou langona ti ngā mali whaa noa noa. Ua le maua whoini upo e whono whono ayo mātou loto nuti mo moia. Le ala le olo mātou o atu male loto whaa tua tua i lāua fio. Mōri tau atu o mātou māwhatianga ma whaa noa noa nga. E le ngātou mātua o uso, tua whaa whine o didi, a e whaa pēnā voiona a inga ma uo pēleina. Ina uro mātou mautinoa, e nga o lā ua fio e mawailo mātou māpsanga. Mātou wā la au, i au maile mālosi malo while e mu e lā e iai o mātou loto mā nganga. Au mai whoilo mālama lama se isu sulu, i wā enga po uli ulingia o mātou loto o no le whanoa noa. U uma wina mātua maa inga mai mātou uma e ua au māwhanufana. Lango lango mai lo ua nganga i lo mātou vai vai. Tau tai lā ua fio i lo mātou ola i aso o luma nai. Nei mānu mā lo le whanoa noa ma le le mau tonu i o mātou loto. Mō mātou whanoa noa ai e pei o e ua le ai se whanoa e moe. Lord of life, you conquer death, which opens the way for a life eternal. We come before you today because someone we love dearly has died. Someone special to us, someone precious and irreplaceable. We do not have the words at this moment to express what we are feeling. No words that can alleviate our sorrow or take away our pain. So we come today simply 
to bring before you our grief, our shock and pain, to bring to you the emptiness, the anger and despair that we feel, as well as the fear and the uncertainty which overwhelms us at this time. We come bringing those honestly before you and asking for your strength and light at this time of darkness. Hold on to us, even though in our grief we find it hard to hold on to you. Support the parents and siblings, the families and friends and loved ones of Didi, as well as us all in the days ahead, and grant them and us the comfort you have promised until the time finally comes when we can look back, not just with pain, but with thanksgiving, not just with sorrow, but with joy. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, the resurrection and the life. Amen. Yeah. To a far wow tato mori mau. Leo teva ya to pay ya to a limas full tato mori mau with toy. The malo alon sa. Alon sa. Salofa. Ya. Ole a a matsalier mo ni mawi se vi ingol alangi na de matso asosia fa fa fine ni okilani. Ya pol asosi fo yolo ya itsonu ya ya didi. Ya ole asosi le yolo ya uma ya fa fa fine sa mo itsonu okilani. Ya. Olo fa pia fo yoi onisi o oso pon cho fa fine ya on cho ngane. Pun ini justru for i ya cik macam tu, ayat si bala awat sule macam tu, apa i pesi sab bali melu itu, nufak pun mule.
เดี๋ยวแล้วไม่ไฟมังเวียคุยยังไงมังกวดคุยยังไงเจ้าสกสิกวดีดิเอ้ยโอเจุลาอิเลเน่อิจุลาลาฟิอาฟิมาลูกว่าพัดเลยชาวทัลฟูอิมันฟาลูอาลูโอเจฟาชาลูฟาชวายลีบามาลูสาวนิงาฟาลายงาอิเลเน่อิจุลาลาฟิอาฟิโอเจฟาชาลูฟาชิฟูอิชาชาโยลูชาชาอินดาลีเน่สาวนิงาฟาลายงาโมเอสิชาสิเปลี่ยนชาวทัลอยากไปเลี้ยงฝุ่นยาเสพมาจบอยากเล็กเจ้ามาเชื่อเราสิลาสิลาแล้วเอาหน้าฝั่งเจ้าบ้าอยากเอาเลี้ยงวัวเอ็นนี่ใครอยู่อยากเอลูสฟุตมันบาลุเจ้าสังเกตโอลเซมินเน่โอลูซูจูอัตซัสีเอลีฟายาเสียไอ้นะโอเซซาวาลีบาลีไม่ละลอยอีเฮสติงส์เดินดูโอลูไปมาฟุ่นละเอาเดินอับอยากโอลูไปฟุ่นมาซามาเจ้าอับ Ya, ay may sema sa ulo sa usia sa matawa. O tay fa sa ilay ay ngot di mo le nay ano fa aro o at suin na may at sa uwe fa sa sa lang ang posible mal. Ya, o a o a o si sa siyo o mama ay di di sa mama fa sa inin usila ay fa sa o sa may sa mo ya o la ubo le sa yay ni may sa ilay o di di. อยากเอาเชียร์ลอยสิลาฟิอาเลอังเอาทีนี้ฟ้าเปียฟูอีเอ็นมาฟังงานเนี่ยเปียกว่าเปียกอยากเอาเชียร์ชูไลเลเน่อาฟิอาฟิอยากเอฟิอาฟิเอสมุนมาลมาฟังงานอยากเอาเชียร์ลอยอยากเอเอสเอมาฟูอีมาฟังงานมาโจวัวทีนี้อีเลอังเอาทีนี้โอ้ในเอาเชียร์ลอยเอเชียร์เลวเมียอีเลฟ้ามาสไลด์ทีนี้ลุนอังเอา Ang celo mo ay fam sa lamay at si Matso o na wala mamay. Iya na mama sa ni Matidi ilevoli sa fayale mangele le fasas fitu sa fayale mangele peor sports level at kenge sa mamit sa ina Matidi o le olpo level na fayale mafenga wala Matidi. Iya mahe ano le voli na sa fayale Matidi o si voli e voli fay Matidi. Iya or sa imi fa sa usam sa mo le isit sa avali. O tiri la, ya luat so ya so umma mana o ya luma ada o voli ya, voli ay umma umma voli so na okilani, o na lu tiri ma ada ya, ay cak si la vale ay umma mal fak boy boy o me umma, o zama, o o o le fak boy boy la vale na me umma ma la le o na ma o inai su ay ngam me, abili mai ya cak fay mai cak le voli o fat, la le voli cak cak o fay le voli fay na le o le le ya zama le voli ay, o fat ya okay cak o. Ah oh, ah macam lo uang langgan fengal dua ngai sono ni usila. Sa fisosuani ya tiri ya cia utse leu cai mi. Ia oleh fisosuani fu ya tiri. Ia na ah macam fu ona le angal lo uang langgan fengal dua ngai sono ni usila. Ia awa awa utsa u fengal dua ngai po. Jua u mah naval afors full dual po. Ai bilia tu tiri ia su tofi. Fai mai mah naval full. Kau ai sia fu mai. Tao tata fao le royals. O fai atu. E ma tala la su tuf. Ma ia. O le po la vale na a mata me na owi loa. E ma na ia sa o le ta fao po la su tuf. Ma na ia fo le ta fao po la su lulu. A a sao tiri ma tia. O fai mai. O yai sao tupe o fai atu. Na le su full wono ta la le tono la kaad. Fai mai fe tsa wi la va ma le su full fi tsa la le ia tia. O le tia le lao tsa ini. E ma te... E ma te of ma fa ma te pepe lu ma te naia sina ma fa ya mama sa u mea te fa alava e ma te fa o ia e mua mua lava o ki ia ma u fa ma e tina le al mea la lenta fa o lenta tupe ia fa pia mea la e vai le luas furu lei lei lunga le chasing tapeu e tu ton ia lua ulu e tu ton o le o fa le le fa le o fia fia nga ia pe o ma fa tanga na sa a ma te me ma te di ia o a u foi le ma fa anga na a wai e te di tu ton o le o le asosi le o le Auckland Samoa Queens Association o le asosi mo fa fa fine it sonu au kilani ia sa o fa tsia tiri ta o ta ti join le melia e ma wai fo inisi mele le ma nisi ma fo fa ngal le o na o te lo a o tiri o le fa fa fine na fa na wini ni usila e mi mitsa la wai fa mai o a o le New Zealand pon fa ele fa yan fa la la belo New Zealand pon 
fai mai o lo pa pa e o fat ele fai fo in fala vela velo pa pa e ma se mi sala va ce le o tsai mi e ya i tsai mi ma se no fo no fo no ma sala no ai me fa pia e le e le tsai mi sa ma sala no ai le sila fia tsa si o li le i o ya john sa ma sala no fa pia po wa ni tsa fo li nga pe a a tsu tsa fast food pe ma na na o fo ni tsa ma ya tsa o na vai tsai ale wa sola le uso ele a tsol tsol se fu o tiri fo i o tse lwe e tso a tsele tso ni i ele o sila fia i o tiri sa faila na wo o tse fa am ia ya tiri o na o tiri sa faila relationship a tiri so o le relationship a tiri o se tsa se o wo ma mai mai sa mo sa malanga mai fo i ne na o fa ya tsia tiri tsa o e pit e e tsa tsio e ha fo e pit sia friend o la tsua o meni usila o la fo fia tsa fao ai o ma o pitsi me la wo ma o ma tsa fao fo ma se friend le tsia au le le yo didi that i o le new zealand born le tsi o fa ya tsu lo ya didi wo ma na mo la wo fa le o fa ya tsu didi na fa ma la wo tsi au le le a fa ma yak o fa ya tsu are you sure fa ma ia Fatsu, oi, fayalai, oi. Lua vai asu taluai, wale to an watu di de piki ap le voli. O fayatsu, o fea oi famai, not feeling well. Ala wa ho oi one hangai piki la wo. Le wa sao pasi lo fale. Ae yo oi one hangai piki la wo. O le maftanga le atiri ma siap friend sa a matza ma yala, wa ya fai nga wo. O fa apea tsu le le uso, ia o le a tsu watu ia oi. That's what so I feel fear fear. So if I pay for your matter and noah, so I'll share it on Facebook. Eli has on a matter and noah, but if I pay me a tear, I owe five people. It's a fear made of honor. Whether I owe to me or matter and noah, or for yet here, that I owe five for my I have to pay five people. Or I owe made of honor. That's oh oh it, oh oh it's made of honor. Le na na o lo fa ya tsu na o tsi lo e o me le o tsi le mrs yo ma we fa ipo ipo a wa o o ya ma tsa la no a o tiri o se tsanga tsa lo tsu ma wa la lo se tsanga tsa ya ma lu o se tsanga tsa file mu e e se la fia o ma ma tso ka la pune ya tiri mo na winga o se tsanga tsa e e le nga o ya o tsi lo e se la fia fo tso tsi le o si wa tiri o se tsanga tse tsa se file mu a ya se ve vesi se mea ele tse tse e va ya tse ya tiri o alu e fa tse pu se ve vesi ma na o la va tiri tsa se file mu um ya o tse lo ya e misia la va ya tiri o na mafutsanga mo tsia ai ele se se pu le finalo le ali ya wo a batse wa tiri tso ma futsa ma no tsa pa au le lang ya e tsa tso ba ho pe tsa tso la lo ne po o yo ma tso ma ba enga le la so o tse lo sa o fa ya tso la o ma tsa e ya le o wa a be o ma tsa nga tsa le le a e tso o ma la o fa le 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 wa a ma tsa ya tiri o na o tiri o se tsa nga tsa mi o le le o tse fa tsa e ma tso o tiri lo tsa o singa o o inga sa fa pe o na a be ya tiri um if there was one thing that i learned from tiri was to be patient um, that was something that he had. She was very patient. Like, even if we were to stand at a queue at McDonald's, I would run out of patience. I said, Kao, you're fali. That's enough. She would wait. She would wait to get to the front. And, you know, I always admired this about her. Even just going to the petrol station, I find that such a big job, Didi would just turn to the petrol station when she needs to. O isi aso, e mati feo wa ilita avali wa leva na mumule mo li pensin. Feo wa ila vay lunga lfa tua tua. Iyo e. O na ma tso o tanga tsa kiriso. O te, fa fitsay lava mo awa onga sa awa maya diri matso ma fitsanga. O te, sa o malanga maya lo, ili aso fa raile. O le si vay aso tsado na maliw di, le wa a tsoa nele lua vay aso lunga ine. Le la wa o fea tsia diri. Alu ya aveni musi musi unga lele la pule longa wenga ke fo ya kudwa unga for falu kile kwe fenga wenga ono alfa tsalinga le uso fenga tsal mafutanga sifa tsai lava la inga tiri mo le amana iyo matso mafutanga ma le uso 
ya tidi tsafi malalo malanga langi ba waso no foanga le lem so no foanga le le ya i and what to say for me so no foanga out of what koe inga ya o matsolo faanga e batse mo tidi ya o lo momoli mai fo ya lo faanga o nisi uso e le ma faiona away mai le ne yaso ya matsolo faanga le aso si nei fa pia ya e momoli atsi le ainga o tidi ai mai se matsu o tidi sua fa yesu amen Ole a fa umaina fo ile maso le mo ma we se si te se le a suina le ma fa tsanga nei fa fa tsai Let's go. 
Hello everybody, my name is Trisha. Please bear with me as I try to get through this. I hate speaking in front of crowds. I'm more of a behind the scene kind of person. Um, and Didi knew this. But there was a day we were talking about if one day we had passed away, we'd want to look beautiful, cake-faced and hot. The other thing she told me I had to do a muli mau. I hated the idea, but here I am but just wasn't expecting to do it so soon. I met Didi around eight years ago through Mele. We were training to go to New York to do a marathon. That didn't happen, of course. Life got in the way, or should I say boys. And since then, we've been in and out of boot camps, making boot camp people rich, and we would be poorer. Still looking the same, or just a little bit more on the luxurious side. Sometimes I would wonder if we just joined so we could watch hot guys show us how to exercise, or join for the celebrations at the end where we partied like we lost 10 kilos. We loved boot camps, but we hated running. Sometimes we'd return up to our trainings and we see the group just about to leave to go for a run. We would sit in the car and wait for the first person to make it back. And then we would get out and pretend like we just got there. We always paired up for boxing. She had one of the strongest punches. I had to remind her a lot of the time, sis, I'm a real girl. And she would just laugh and continue hitting the pads. <clears throat> Her photo that's used on the badge and the shirts. Um, uh, was the night of um, the end of our six or eight week challenge, I think it was. We were supposed to wear red. And I found a red dress and she said, yep, I found one too. But it ended up being pink. She did that to me all the time. Like, sis, we have to wear blue. And she would say, nah, just wear whatever colour you want. And on the day, she'll turn up in blue and me in black. <clears throat> that night, this night was her funny. Um, we left the function in Odahu and the rest of the night was a blank. We woke up around 6am, parked outside this house in Takanini, and no idea how we got to the front because we were both at the back when we left Odahu. Her say she's wearing is hanging in the car that she gave me before she left for Aussie. Oh my gosh. Didi and I's relationship was based on truth, no judgment, trust, and we would discuss anything and everything. From what we're eating to what we were wearing to the boys in our lives or potential ones. We would discuss good things and bad things about life, family, people in general, and mostly naughty things. That I can't mention up here, sorry. <laughs> um, when she was here, we would do midnight runs to McDonald's and anybody who knows her knows that she loves her food. <clears throat> And when she ordered her burgers, she pretty much just had the meat, onion, and mayo. Other nights, we would do midnight runs to each other's house because we ran out of smokes, or just to hang out or ask, do you have coins? I'm thirsty. She was someone 
that when organising things wants everything perfect. She wants to make sure there's always enough food and the setups are spot on. She was such a private person and would only share her personal situations with a selective few. She loved the cold, a man she had a nose that would smell anything good or bad. She hated my driving. A lawalo useless. Every time I took the long way home and didn't want to, to go the way she wanted. If we had planned to go somewhere and I was too tired, again, useless. If I told Jenny something about what we would talk about, but she told me not, she didn't say not to tell her, she would say, eh, lungukule malalinga. We will talk about starting up our trainings again, but she will do it in Aussie and I'll do it from here. She would say, eh, I'm sick of this channel. Please change the channel. I guess we both wanted to start training, but we missed each other, but never said it. We weren't the emotional type towards each other, but we knew, but we knew when one was sad, or one needed to let steam out. <sighs> she was my go-to. <clears throat> we would get things off our minds and everything would be okay. So these past few weeks have been extremely hard. How this girl loved her mother. She would drop anything or even leave work to do whatever it was her mother asked her or needed. <clears throat> like I would be talking to her and I'm in the middle of a juicy story and she'll just hang up on me, no goodbye or nothing. She'll ring back and say, oh, sorry, that was mum. <clears throat> I'll continue my story and she'll hang up on me again. Oh, sorry, mum forgot something. I got used to it after all. Her mum was her queen, and she was her mum's princess. Didi was a person that, like many of us, craved to be accepted for who she was by those she loved. Those months she was in Australia, it was hard for her in the first couple of months as she had to try and adjust to a new norm. But as the months went by, she was finding herself. She started to filter through all the people that wouldn't accept her. Um, and the people that were left there were the ones that genuinely loved her. I will tell her, sis, I know it hurts, but you need to start up with people. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I will tell her, sis, I know it hurts. But if you're not straight up with people about who you are, you won't know the good from the bad ones. And then you'll be wasting your even more time trying to get their approval. She cared too much, and in this incident, she cared way too much. We spoke two hours before that tragic incident for about an hour. It was um, saying it nicely, our happy hour. And I just remember us both laughing and mocking the other about our night out. And I'll always remember you this way. You deserved better. You deserved more. This was not the way you were supposed to come home. You had planned to come in January for your mum's birthday. Me and Jenny were going to pick you up. Go eat at your favourite sweet and sour place. Then it was party from there but instead you came home like this. <clears throat> so many things we could have done or said to avoid this tragedy, but we can't keep dwelling on it because it won't bring you back. You are my go-to person, you are my conscience, tell me right from wrong, and I will miss you forever. <clears throat> There are so many stories and so many memories, but we'll leave it there and we'll definitely share another time. 
Thank you to Sina, Foy, Mele, and the family for allowing us to be a part of the process because we wouldn't have been able to give her this kind of send-off without your love, consent, and support. Also, would like to thank Sina and anybody else who used to give Didi money in the weekend to support our bad habit of going out and coming back home early hours in the morning. Didi, my sister, to another mister, if there was anything in our relationship I did wrong, please forgive me. Sao long e yalu. May you save a seat up there for me, because when we meet again, we're going to have a lot to talk about. I love you, Manuela Malanga. God is good. All the time. All the time. Um, lava. Mole Mole of Noah Womamo for a talo for a two Elipa e Malmamal was a more potu potu is to assume a faith and fang out for the tour Opa e Ainga Angalua O war way for a tat masangi O tato for a tati mine Tato Mulimau, the Asofia fear or the Uso ear diri pese. Ia fa amang anu mea tia o wa fei lo moli mau ingilisi ai le 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 lo fa sa moa. There was a weekend where um, Didi had texted me and she said, "Ching ching." I replied back saying, "Huh?" She messaged back saying, "I read." I replied back to her saying, what? She messaged back to me saying, Kaluk. <laughs> I was not bothered. So I picked up the phone and I called her and I said, what are you talking about? Didi laughed and said to me, Suma, you're so behind. This is the Samoan Fafai Fina lingo words. It was then that she had taught me these lingo words. And up till now, we still use these words because of Didi. Um, for those of you who do not know me, my name is Fatu Savia. My preferred name is Fakoya. Everyone knows me as Koya. I had no idea in 2004. We both went to the same high school. Didi was just starting year seven as I was just finishing my last year, my last year in year 13. In the middle of 2004, that's when I had met Didi at Auntie Melly's house. We would have bring it on practice and in her backyard. And I just remember Didi sitting on Auntie Melly's balcony, staring, watching and staring at us and just watching us and admiring our dance. At that time, I thought to myself, Didi is going to be a diva when she grows up. <laughs> After high school, me and my family had moved to Australia. In 2015, I came back. And that's when I met Didi again. My instincts were true. She was a diva. <laughs> she, she was a diva. It was then that me and Didi had built our relationship for seven years. It wasn't until three years that we became close friends and she was one of my closest sisters to me. It took me three years to really get to know Diddy. Diddy's infectious energy enabled me to be very drawn to her. She was truly a woman of grace and dignity. She was very shy and humble at the same time. Didi was a party girl, but she was also a church girl. I have known Didi to be very family orientated. She always valued her family and culture 
over anything and over individualism. I have no one dare to be so devoted to her family, emotionally and physically. And this is why I'm so connected to Didi. Because she led by an example, by teaching me and showing me and reminding me how important it is for my family and my culture. And I'll always thank her for that. Over three years, we created so many memories together. And if I could just share, please, one memory of me and Didi. I know Didi's wondering right now, where you been not talk about those memories that we have created. But no, Didi. I won't because they stay between us. It was the second week before she had moved to Australia. And it was that week she had told me that she was moving. It was a Friday afternoon. She had texted me to say, and then I replied back saying to her, yeah, got ching ching. <laughs> we laughed and instantly made plans that night. I'm so sorry. Please bear with me. Um, Didi came over the afternoon with Trish and Didi. She can be very tricky at times because they come looking beautiful, but she comes looking plain and simple because she will always want me to do her hair and makeup, which I did. <laughs> Um, I did her makeup, and I thought I would change something in her. I said to her, okay, I'm going to let you wear one of my wigs. Surprisingly, she said yes. She was so happy. Um, so I did her hair and makeup, and at the end, I said to her, oh my God, you look afagasti. Make your wig afagasti. And she got so excited that her head almost blew off. She came to my house with this low self-esteem. When I had told her that she looked off gussy, her self-esteem was right up here. So she was excited. We were getting ready to go out that night. So we got to the club from, um, from among us for me. Uh, we got to the club and one of these first songs came on. And so we went to the dancing floor. Daddy was doing this move. <laughs> Together with her legs going like this, it's almost as if she's crumpy. And at the same time, she was nodding her head back and forth. And she was just having a good time. I looked at her and I said, oh my gosh, her wig is gonna come off. <laughs> so I had to grab her, went to the restroom, and I reminded Diddy, girl, don't forget that you weren't awake. So don't down too hard. And she was like, oh my God, fix it, fix it. So I did, repositioned the wig. Um, so we went back to the dancing floor. This time, one of her first songs came on. Diddy, we went to the dancing floor. She stood there and she was moving like that. <laughs> And I understood why, because she didn't want her work to come off or fall off. Um, yes, these memories is what's comforting me, and these memories of Didi is what's keeping her alive in my heart. I thank you, Didi, for being in my life and for having to create so much memories together. Thank you for everything that you have done for me. And thank you for um, always supporting me and being there for me. If there's anything that I've said, if there's anything that I've done to hurt you, 
Did he find my hand or may he forgive me? I just want to say that it's so unfortunate they have come across these unexpected situations. It makes you realize, it makes you think how it has put everything into perspective. It gives you that message and you question yourself, what have we learned from this? I can say that it's life. Don't take for granted just because we're all in good health, just because you're young and beautiful, just because you're in, you're financially good. Sorry, I'm just trying not to in case my lashes come off. <laughs> we just don't know when our time will come. We just don't know when God will take us. So, my answer to what I have learned from this duty is that to always make time for your friends, to always be there for your friends and family. It's been so hard for me because I haven't been visiting Diddy since she came. I'm so sorry, Diddy, that I wasn't able to do your hair and makeup. Do you understand the pain that I'm going through? I'm so sorry, everyone. Please forgive me as well. Um, I think it's so important that we don't, um, don't ever hold back or let your worries or concerns take that away from you or suck that away from you. We are all here for a reason. You're here alive. I am here alive because we have a reason. And that reason is because we all have a purpose. And Diddy, I'm so jealous right now because you can finally sit in the arms of our Lord Jesus Christ. He's comforting you right now, Diddy. But I do ask that you do give your mom the strength. I know how much you love your mom, but I pray that you watch over your family. Thank you so much. Fluffy Tai Lover, your Manuel Manangati. Well, just before I close off, I would like to invite all the divas to please come forward, please. The divas from the Molly. Um. Just to finish it off with a song, and um, the last song that we're about to sing is Dedicated to Diddy. It is a song that had made her the woman who she is. It is the song that she turns to when she needs when she needs it. She also taught us the song as well, whenever we need to feel like a woman. So, fuck it, I love her. <laughs>
David. Yeah, those are David's friends. And I believe that's his second home. Yeah. I family at the Lewis Fum Leva Tausana Fayela Yala Muni Mau. Yeah. Or they were too far from Fung a war. A David, they were too far from Fung a the cousins or David. A ole tama, i a leo faya te lua suluiva tau sanga ole la faya la u la u muri mau. Yeah, in that note, ele umi sakala. Ole uatali, I'm sorry, o te tau ala vo ole uatali. 
Yo nga lan o ore tama. Na o fa na ore tama. Ore tama. Yo. But ilona no sutasion to sang. O ina fo to talia ina. Yere tu langa o ye filfilia. Yo ilona no sutasion to sang. Yo. Ya. I tell you, for long, was really no. What did it? Of a pair of fat. Oh, sorry. It is so calm, more, 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 more. I feel my soul called Lua. My way. Of a gaming. Well, the full volume of some alternative feeling, feeling a lawyer, yes, we don't know. Yeah, if I pay an alley or longer than me. Yeah. Or they allow to tell all of our fair to the water, you don't lose suit of sanger. Ota liar tu langa olo yai oe, au te taua oe olo watali'i, o te I will call you, still call you David, because ole ingoa nga ngu ufa ingoa ingai oe, te mina e whanau mai yai. Eo e. Ea, si o watali'i. Eo e. O David. Ole wii. Ea, se ito lo foi, baane foi, se ito lua nei. E tolu mata ma mua mua ma la malontina. Ale ma i muri muri na lia. Se tu lo. Fa mai le tala sina. E ese la na fa lomo. O fa mta langa fo ile no fa mta lai lo na lusu tasion tausanga. Yeah. E ma sandi ai lavo fa finge la tauia. I i i tu langa fa pewa uia le fa na uia le tanat. Yeah. Fa mai ese la na fa lomo na ilo la uia to tolu mua mua. Fa mai olana fa along wa ole ole taine. Ye wo to fia fia fo ya wa fo wa to lutama. Le u shu stai. Yo. Ah le pe sa ka lu fo wi lo ala is taine. Ye ole u pa na lu china. O ti fa along wa ole taine. Yo. Ya i pe tai ya. E fa na wa ne ole tam. Yo. Ole mbe na le o te le o mauti no ai lava ilo mafu fa wai pia no fa tu te mi watea fa pia yo na mau runga le langi la langi fa pia nga le mau runga manga ma awala o le tua na ilo tato yo ele i fo se tanga te fa masino wala fa mel upol tus a wo te fa masino tu ina ne fa masino ina o yo tu o ile tua Tu ile tu me fa pea. Awo cha surprise pa ela kule langing au tiva ela ku me lang. Don't be surprised when you come to heaven is only divas in heaven. Yeah. Fi wa so elfa fi au. Yeah. Fi wa so ele 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 ya ko ino. Yeah. No fi wi ka fa. Yeah. Or the farm sinonga, a fire there too. You lay fire oil map. Or not waterly, Paul or not waterly, a lady till for some more. I never know in a yellow mamma. So when a man lay your for some more, and I know. How for all what to lay a I send my text to you with a summer. Yeah. I know I know you. Yeah. Ele misi foi se a sua tamba. Talo foi tamba o amor e o foi a o a calo foi a mesma alo foi. Yeah. Yeah. Esse foi o wing o leite ngata. Yeah, mano, ele foi ele se muri mau foi bem. He's unique. You are. You learn a personality. You are. You are therefore that you follow along with me. You tell me you love me. You share what I tell you. You are. Then you follow along with me. You follow along with me. You are. Then I'm so with you. Or maybe I'm not afraid to be alone. Now, I'm not looking for your time. I'm afraid to be alone. You are never going to be alone. You are never going to be alone. Aku jeli fiaf ayat tu omel masih setama. Upu ane yang lain ufaya yang mili. 
it's very hard for a father to accept things like that. So I said things like that. Yeah. But, Kumfayai. Yeah, Kumfayai. You see, Wakali. Yeah, along Allah, 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 if a kaya yala would eat my koya for me, it's a loof I come along. Fuck all, we say a quano table. Billy make out for me. Ah, look my folk at Oscalia. Fuck all, if I may all remove for it. Of a good day. If I could lay what live among our cabs. Yo, live and go mga oki kuwale nest. Leave the nest and fly. Fly away. Yeah, the sky is the limit. Spread your wings. Go, follow life. Stand on your own two feet. Yeah. Mako, follow. Mako, fa mava yung mga wakali. Yeah. Yeah, or to see Mulimulia and Ufaita, yeah, the poor in her. It matter for Mava and all the two silly alley. All the two poor soul mona. No, no, for it, yeah, the poor now for to far long. For to far long by the Upula soul mona. The two put out the oil at the mic. You're not for it, oh, for a person, yeah, yeah. My son, do not forget my teacher. But keep my commands in your heart. For they will prolong your life many years and bring peace and prosperity. Let love and faithfulness never leave you. Bind them around your neck and write them on the tablets of your heart. Then you will win favor and a good name in the sight of God and men. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways submit to him and he will make your path straight. Do not be wise on your own eyes. Fear the Lord and shun evil. It will bring health to your body and nourishment to your bones. Honor the Lord with your wealth, with the first fruit of all your crops. Then your barns will be filled with overflowing and your vats will brim over with new wine. My son, do not despise the Lord's discipline. Do not resent his rebuke. For the Lord disciplines those he loves as a father, the son that he delights in. Ilana Falong. Yen Alu Rolea. Ealo Oma Fanfana. What a tall, say Upu to Ton Molita. Yalu Law. Wamawa on a fale. Yo, a fale for a while will rent. Yapu and my data. Wa mimita, bu e mai data ya ma o masio to o lo nei langa step mum. For mai, for mai vai. Look, 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 look. Fale ma ngai ya alu. Toi le video. Ye na o ai do muku kaluang el pusa isa. Tetar el pusa isa le asa se fi vai ya. Tetar el pusa isa alu pu e mai le video. Yeah. Ova cha mai le wui. Talu fa se o atari le ni me ai o le pusa isa. Yeah. 
Ya mata no lo fai atu. Fai mai. Ai lo po wan wo be si uma me ai ai po mai le ato le. Ole 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 pu sai. Ya ma to we a le o fai atu. Si la fu sembe tama. Ya na ave ya na chu pe fa ata wai. Ai lo pe na uma to wai to ela wa ne na me tu to no le pu sai. Yo. Winga ma li o le ta mai ti. Mo wala ta avale. E o ia la fa pe o mo motu e le tua ia le o langa o le tama i lo na lua su viva. A o ma lie lo u loto i lo uva a iatu i langa a tjimenant. I si nei te impu upu una lua tua i Australia. Mo wala na fale mo wala ta avale. Eo e. Eo ta avale na ma fio a ia i no matu atu e o mai e a o mai nei. Eo e. Mato feo o iai ia. E mata ngo fie, iele wingo le tangata pe i lava ona, maali e ai te leo. Sa o noa nga foi, mo moni mau. O ol te min whanau mai ai, na uo po ina ma. Wrap him in a blanket. This morning at eight o'clock, I tuck him in bed for the last time and seal his coffin. I said to him, We will meet again. Yala, to that you never know. You shall do more, Faisana. I'm Talanga. Reverend Eperone Futi, um, Pastor Anipon Fawcil, who's in the overflow. To, um, and you're definitely going to heaven, Tafai. Um, but I'm going to speak in English. Um, uh, eulogy for my stepson, for my beautiful Didi. Um, When you're a woman, it's an honour to be a mother. And there are some women who make a decision not to have children, and that's their prerogative. And there are some women who would love to have a child, but they cannot. So it's an honour to be a mother to my four children, Aveloa, Marina, Amanda and Benjamin. So it is an even more of an honour when you can love. It's a privilege to have stepchildren that you love because the, the mother gives you trust to bring up her children and to protect them and to discipline them. So I have been honoured to have Asalafa, Thomas, Nathan, Bati, Philip, and the girls, Sarah, Sape, Zina, and also Peau. These children are seen as children, not just for his children, but they're my children too. Also their spouses and the grandchildren starting from Michaela, Jonathan, Yasmin, Carissa, Primrose, Oriana Setu, Oscar, Mila, and our new boy, Caleb. But the baby that we brought up, who's the same age as my child, Benjamin, Dee Dee, has passed away. I met all my stepchildren in 1996. Dee Dee was only three years old. He was cute, he was adorable beautiful long eyelashes and as Didi grew up when he was five years old I worked in Manukau so I would pick up Didi from primary school in Dawson Road um, that'd be the weekend that we would have Didi and I'd chat away like I'd always do to try and have a conversation and Didi would sit there quietly and sometimes tears would be streaming down his cheeks because he loves his mum so much 
and his grandmother, La Sela, and his grandfather, Tutor. So for a young child, sometimes it's difficult, even if he's coming to his father and to his stepmother. I don't think I ever saw Didi cry again after all those years, but I remember that very well when we used to drive to Pukekaui. And I loved on her with Benjamin, they were the same, same age. Over those years, Didi grew up and went to De La Salle and did extremely well. She was quite smart, she was bright, and when she graduated in Form 7, Year 13, she had developed and grown into this beautiful persona, beautiful personality. Yes, Rachel's right. She grew to become a, a girl, and it's what she wanted. And I supported her in every way. Why? Because our God is a good God. And he made us. We're wonderfully and fearfully made. So I stood by her every step of the way. It was hard for her father, for he's spoken to you about it. But we're Christians, if we say we're Christians, and we love on our children and love on people, we love them no matter what. So I stood by her every step of the way. I was proud of her. Yeah. And um, when she was 19, we developed that amazing relationship. Um, Patricia's um, mentioned it, we were training, we were doing marathons, we were doing mud races, and Sina entrusted me to take her daughter to Rotorua. We were like, not like stepmum and stepdaughter, we were like maybe older sister and younger sister. Well, that's why I like to say, say it, but we had so much fun. And I was always there for her. She'd talk to me about things that are taboo, things that people don't want to talk about or hear about, but she'd share everything with me, and I'd give her good advice. And her body language is probably better than her vocals at the time. If she didn't like my advice, she suddenly went quiet or rolled her eyes. That's just the way Diddy was. But boy, she was respectful. She knows her culture. Um, she was brought up in the church with La Sela and Tutua. I've even attended a service with her grandparents. La Sela and Tutua were lovely grandparents and they were so lovely to me. And then the relationship that she has with her mum. You know, Sina is a woman who goes above and beyond. She is very generous. She's very, very good to her extended family, her sisters and her brothers, her nieces and nephews. And she loves her children very, very much. Her love for Didi, though, was extra special. Why? Because it's like her right-hand man, right-hand person, the shoulder to lean on. Yeah. And Sina. I know this is a very, very difficult time for you, but we are here for you. Um, the one thing I want to mention is that when we went to Melbourne and we saw Didi's home, we were so proud of her. Her car, her appliances, a brand new townhouse. She did everything she could to lead an independent life. And the second thing I want to bring up is the Divas and the Queens and the De La Salle group and your volleyball group. You came over the other night and sang at Haybridge at Sina's home. And you know, the interesting thing was, you were all singing hymns, praying prayers. Your whatsapp was amazing. As a collective, you're an amazing group. And you were there for our child. And you know things about Didi, and spoke to Didi, and conferred with Didi that we don't know. And from the bottoms of, bottom of our hearts, we thank you for being there for her, for loving on her. And I say to you too, that you are fearfully and wonderfully made. Stand tall like Dee Dee, walk like a peacock, because that's what she did. She never, she never had her shoulders over, she walked straight and dignified. And I want you to as well. I thank you, Annie, Jenny, Trisha, for the time that we spent at the funeral home and you did her hair and her makeup, and she looked cute and adorable, and her natural eyelashes were long. So, Foy, I know this is hard for you, my darling. And to see Naimata'u. 
but fly high, Dee Dee, not just fly high, fly high maintenance, like you always have. <laughs> we love you, my darling. Mangwelo malanga. Of tai. Of of tai. Um... A faye le o yes pol kalame la tole wo el fa solonga ya le la bala watu. O si pa o ma le si le wo el fa solon. Allo la bala on site. We're trying to make the five hour mark. We're halfway there. So um, hold on to your horses. See if there way to go. Aftai. God is good all the time. Yeah, I tell you, need to laugh. Yeah, if you want, like long as I'm still in there, no phone, no phone, my tattoo. Yeah, I be a wife, I'm a suyole. Ma, I'm malang a misa moa. That's all my little silly feel. I'm not saying that. Oh, ah, Lisi, oh, the first cousin, oh, Didi, the side, oh, Tina. I tell you, Lord, yeah, only need to laugh. If you have. E mole toy na fa tay tele la ba ile tay tay sa uninga ai nga lua nga tay dia o bo mai ma san mo fa yo na awai mai ni tu la fia e bon ma wina le a sofia fia o le pele ya tidi e le u mi la ba se mo ma o no de la fol fala fa tay le tu o mo ni fi lo inga ma ta mo fie ma ta no mai mai se ti na me sa mo Ilias Tofi, Allah Sululu Leana, Tom Utsuaya, Dilili, Lifali, Ole Simon Mau, the Mamma of Tang, Ote Lord Didi, Ye or Sitanata for Eva, Latin Mamma of Tang, Ile, or me Umalava, Pokalami Umalava, Show Matu Ainga, Ye, Papi Naun, So Swan, Ye Toy Lava, Ye Didi, Ole Mafilo Inga Muli Lava. Nah melangkah cuai oya, ia mesti naya sina. Ile madu fuyu sub samai samua. Eh, ile mafe ona cuai ma samjuanga ilu buat telefon, video call. Sao sangat si Mei ya November. Oleh sebab nau nau sub sinai cuai luna, ona sukses. Nau mafau fau lava efir fai luna sebab nau. Ia ufa api halawa lak cuai nanti. Oba la aw mai ile ile usai hati. If you have a sick girl as far now, she'll see now. Yeah, Ellie, he tell it to her, he may not fall over our way. So, but be at all, well, it's so easy, Fally. The outcome for you is so cool, you're a sick girl. Yeah, so, but be now, I'm going to fight, did it? Ellie, I'm going to fall over your chair. So, say me, I'm going to fall over your chair, say some more. But my way, I'm going to fall over your chair. Yeah, I'm going to fall over your chair. Ai ma ai ma te o lava e e a vifa te fau e se longa lava e umba e e na fale e o ele se fale se longa te pumi uma fale calacuisa mo e fa te o ma te o mai fale ele fale o ele se te me malanga tu o ele te fale ele tu no lava e ele pa e a mano mal e a ele ma fale na tu o e te a ele lava pepe e a ele lava e o matiri o no ele o mo o lava no e a tiri e a o lo se la fia ele tu a Ile mafayo na ngalu ele aso lava na mabiao lava na ulo ha ele tichala sa ade mafayo ona tichali malinyo lo himata ona utilo wa mutusia mafuta nga maipili ulfa mungu nga uma lava de wa lava maifayi sa amboa upepa malanga wa lava pela voye e faço o trabalho melhor o malam e o neiro há e o teu olho o teu malanga o limo o momal muda muda foi neiro o teu o mal neiro nem se dá e a faço o trabalho lava tudo em o meu o malam e a a fazer ele tua e a moça não fuma não fuma mal de lang o sal nele tua mas já tua o faço o trabalho lava o faço fuma o faço o trabalho não sai o no Jesus amém Ya, walau maya oleh bahir kakuain.
Ya malul malu ko yo rengis. Ala ban no hinen ma. Yen mi. ตาลุปตาตุมอตาเตเลลาวะเตฟิอาไอซุลุปตาลุปตาตุตาลุปตาตุมอตาลุตาลุปปะเปนาลุปตาลุปตาลุปตาลุปตาลุปตาลุปต
Mulavaya Sina Yamata Before ya Pesem Nel On a les hommes of Oil or Pokalami, Naviliatu, for to let Motinoa. I know confirm Matulo and Mali would take it. That was Wednesday, yeah. Yeah, a solo. You have a come file as we have a no longer mark what plan, Livia you like, if you live at December. You have a time for Molly Pepper and Avatole sounding. You must find a file approval, Kisawa, you have but anyway, I'm sorry if you don't understand my Samoan. Langa amako kaukala fa Samoa. We try to English our mind. Kaukala, so I have to do it in Samoa. I ask that person next to you to interpret for you. Wow. Well, for let's see a stepson to a stepdad, a stepson to a stepmother. Langa, what we first cousin with David? Unfortunately, nga sa ulo kama ng usila when I was just a little boy, kire ibaiso kama. Bela of Hoy Mamele. Let's see the sets of parents. Moa, I'm sorry, Salaf, I'm a cool Salaf. So, Ole, Ola Ikila, David, Salaf, I'm Tanyel. Or I will see Ele, Ele, Oto Masi. If I pung a Varsala Mika, I miss a foam singer. Yakeva, what was Yako Masi? The Salvo Savarina. Fangaulo Nathan. If I ping a foot, was a very cold mass. Oh, you see, David Kaikai, I am a singer of Paul of a lava. I'm a whole war. I've tied for him, my two, I see number, my foy, a lack of fat for for in a foil or longer. Just even one wound. Bear, young moon, my love, and I knew see them. Young sweet foy, let's see some parents of Koya, some of them, my dear. Sam, what ya, um, for your mind, I told you, see, lady. Lua, I feel my Yeah, yeah, I won't cry. I saw more. What would my wine is some more? If I follow the love is a wife, if I follow the love is a core, or what work a moy? Yeah, I have a noise out nearly at two. So, okay, fat man, do work. That's for your essay, someone, Mark. Lang out. Okay, la, okay, I was so sunny if I can't have a yala. Only kill your mulf of a thing. Oh, okay, the addressing us is his own walking. I'm so sorry, brothers. Okay, well, I will have a lack of work. Come on. Ole, may I fellow call it, Mamma Kanga David? Fakolu, ah, Fakolu, Alaku David Sam, what? More inviting a more mullet, Mako Fale, Maumolo Kolu. Oh, Kalango, Ole, yeah, Fak by David. Ole, we are out of David, Ele Ikaia, Ele Fikalamoya cap. Oh, my father, and a little of a look. Like, Lord David, I think it was about fourteen. David, okay, you to me is a brother, a cousin, Langa Safai for your firm sinner. Fano, my way. So I said, Come, my fear, King. Then on the wing on Menga, Makele discovering who he really is. He never understood himself. So I said, Come, my fear, King. Maria, I show brother. I will give you a king. Oh, I are a kama. For Makarakus by God created. Man, ile amakanga in the beginning. If I go to upule man, it's a plural. On a fine ole ole kuwa ole woman, ole male ka ole ole man. A fine ole is a womb man. Then you are a brother. O ingala nga create ilma ma lefiefiele o David yakia. Amakama inga o kaya niya ba David yakia sa vadi ese o sa vadi sa vadi ese. But I speak the truth. Give up, David. Get away. I said, Leo, so look a beep at a comma. I'm a canal, Kalal, Lacuma, Lua, David. Why, Macalono, Lela, I see Camelan, Mulmoco, Annie. Faculam, well, let's have my Gabio, ya, Annie. Fak, why, Annie? Let's have a friend. Oh, Vacu, ya, any folk. Sip sitting at any poor longing walk out then. My Eva, we are Camala, and you from Passang, and if I'm a dear. File, I had then. Oh, any for you to go by. Oh, 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 they go for a little muffin, more any, a little cow, any, a little, any, 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 any,
maybe two nights. You were lying on the hill or ten. Of a chess, I got more of a wife than mine. As King Alasipa, the Wallach of Sipa, Okaru. If you moil of Father, you can get your color, you are young. I suffer my kid if you did not go like a kid, you can't get out. Fire go to a Saga go walk. Macolo Maco, I. Yeah, a pair of small mouth, a woman and lay on the Magotin, a little color table, your color, I fire. But anyway. Yapiao <laughs> Ana kulo le si pa uma se na ano de ti fai la visa va ku es pa va o va ile agent ya e va vela ngale vo ki ma vo ki o le la uma ko mai ala ile mo de visa um si lo mutu le u mo ngale o na la ntama la me liu fo o le ainga fo ya ko inga ma lo ma ku but anyway ya fa fai le tu sa ni ni ever no ta tu fi lo ya o ni fa no no si ka ko fi fi uma pa wan mi ka ko fi ola Pocoyola, a cago fiocchi for Caco Poco for Fiocchi. A woke up from a woman, David, Caco Fiocchi, Lana Fasino Manga Umale Motato, the Ola Peotti, Caco Wola Mokeviso, Yalo Familia Tua, Fama Fan Fanaina Matua, Messia Usoma. A inga, Fapia for you war, Yatainani, to a tello, tattooing, a lofale to a tattoo more not to tell him Fama Fan Fanaina for tattoo. Mau foi leh mau telem mau sesuatu yang mungkin saya sungguh faham. Enggak mau faham tu. Ya, ayah lah fikir fikir ayah David faham. Tapi lah mula mula. Ayah lah sungguh leh awak susah ni. Yang mau terpai. Ya, Annie, Danny, Tomato, Tomaru, Potato, Potato, Permeatas. Ya, faham mula mula lewa. Afa ye fua ilah afa il pol kalame. I am Mul Mamma Mul Mulia. I am a Tuaya Patti, I am Miami, Philip and Samantha. I am a lot of time in May. I say, if you are Mul Mautua to E, I am sorry. Yeah, this is the last eulogy. Ah, to the Mul Maui Fai Falepe, I felt that to me. I Uh, uh, greetings, family and friends. Uh, my name is Albert, or uh, Bucky. Uh, I'm the youngest of all the brothers. Uh, this is uh, Andy, my uh, my partner, and um, my daughter is running around somewhere. Um. Uh, growing up with my sister here, uh, she was such a beautiful individual. Her hair, her sense of style, and her kindness was always on display. She was the planner of the family. Um, I was very easy because she would just tell me what to do and I would just say yes. <laughs> However, one of her biggest traits was how strong her love and loyalty was to mom. And we all knew that. Uh, we, we grew up with, um, with little words being spoken to each other because I'm really antisocial. I like to keep to myself. Uh, however, it, it didn't stop her from always checking up on me and uh, making sure me and uh, my little family was okay. But when growing up with her, being a little headache at the time, there was this one moment I'll never forget. Uh, I wanted to play outside, <laughs> but she wouldn't let me because uh, there was no adults by her at home. 
got to the point where, uh, sorry, uh, I called her a uh, fuffa. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, let's just say I wouldn't say that anymore. <laughs> Yeah, because after a sore body the next day, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was the last time. <laughs> but when she left to Australia, we made plans to meet back up again later on in the year. Before she left, um, she told me she was going to try and get a big house <laughs> so we can visit her. And uh, if I get, if I agreed, I'll move to Australia and live with her. Uh, my Didi, your home looks like it's going to be bigger than expected now. Yeah, your home looks like it's going to be more beautiful than expected now. Your home is where I never thought you'll be right now. So please save me and the girls a spot when our time does come. Uh, I actually wrote all this eight o'clock this morning because <laughs> I was I was still in disbelief of what this day was going to consist of. But no matter, no matter how you left us, all matters is the values and the things you have blessed so many people with. Uh, I never imagined you'll be the one lying here next to me today. So to everyone here today, everyone that's currently tuning in on the live stream, please remember to always check up on each other. Say you love them. Because as we all know, our calling is never planned. Didi, I love you. I'm going to miss you. We'll never stop thinking about you. Till we meet again, sis. Thank you. Good evening. Uh, I think everyone's a bit hungry, a bit tired. Um, all right, so I'll try my best to just fly through this. So, short introduction. It's my wife, Sam, uh, oldest greaser, Primrose, Oriana, my son, I don't know, he's probably running around somewhere, uh, and that's set to. So, we're from Melbourne. Um, so, we've come over, bring Didi home to the family and friends. Um, so, just want to start off, so, just want to thanks, I want to give thanks to everyone that's here today, uh, Reverend, um, thank you for leading us today, uh, our Heavenly Father for bringing us all here safely from near and far, everyone watching this as well, um, no, thanks to, thanks to our parents for bringing up Didi, but most importantly, I think the village that Didi grew up in, um, it, it speaks volume, um, with, Everyone's saying good things about Didi. Um, she was beautiful and she was caring. She was also classy, all right? I've never thought I'd say this, but she was classy and sassy, all right? <laughs> never thought I'd say that. But most of all, she was a loving individual, and I think everyone said that today. A couple of, uh, just some memory lane. Um, when Didi first started school, um, I can't remember, but I do remember the day. Um, so my mom dropped us off to school. Um, I don't know what class Didi was in, but I knew the interval, uh, the, the interval bell went for recess, so 15 minutes. So I thought I'll go check up on Didi. Um, couldn't find Didi. 
uh, I don't know where Didi's class was, but there's this little square um, chair within, uh, in the middle of the playground. Um, <laughs> I just saw a little kid from the back um, just eating a, I think it was a chicken roll or, or, or sandwich, whatever it was. And I thought oh, that could be Didi. So I snuck up, snuck up at the back. And sure enough, Didi was eating his chicken roll, crying. And he was crying and crying. The moment he turned around and realized it was me, he cried even harder. Uh, it's, I still remember it because I had to walk him to his class. Walked him to his class, and you're still crying. So I had to tell him to stop crying. Or he was actually getting on my nerves. Um, he, was getting, he was making me angry. But I held him, over, um, I held him nice and close. And I think it was his homeroom teacher came and tried to separate us. And I'm short tempered, so I swore at her. And there's my detention. And all because of Didi. Anyways, took Didi to class and she was fine. So that was that was Didi's first day at primary school. Like that was her first day. Um I will say this one. So we had a family the best family reunion. Uh, 2008, over in Wellington. I think Didi was 15 at the time. Uh, decided to go spend some time with uh, my wife's um, father at his house in Wellington. Just spent a couple of couple of days there before we come back. So Didi asked to come. He wanted to tag along. So I said, "Oh, you sure? You sure you want to come?" Anyways, I think everyone in my family knows I'm the bad influencer. So I said, "Yep, come. Let's go." So we went, so obviously I went to my favorite shop, uh, the, the liquor store. <laughs> went to the liquor store. Yeah, so, you know, Didi's sitting at the back. And Didi's only 15 at this time. I'm sure of it. Didi turns to me and goes, oh, bro, can you give me some beers? Turn around, I'm like, nope. Then I thought about it, I'm like, ooh, this could be my chance. You know, this could be a chance to get him wasted, absolute trashed off his face. So he was 15 at the time. I got him some beers. Actually, I didn't didn't get him beers. I got him cruisers. It was nice and soft. Whatever. Just wanted to ease him into it. Sorry to my parents for finding this out. So I brought me some smokes, brought me some uh, some drinks, went, and then so we drank. So we drank. I think he had one or two. And he was pacing up and down. He was sweating. He was like, oh my God, I can't breathe. Like, he, you know, all of a sudden he was doing things like, I was like looking at him going, bro, you all right? Like, do, do I need to call the ambulance? Like, you know, sit down or go to sleep. But that was his only second bottle. So, you know, like everyone said, Didi uh, loved to do things big. And unfortunately, I think I was the one who started all his bad habits about drinking and all of that stuff. But it's all good, he was my little brother. Um, Didi as well, a couple of memory lanes, you know. Uh, I'll make it real quick. Uh, so Didi, as everyone said, volley. He loved the sport, he loved the community, he loved everything. He loved to, you know, get involved with people he knew, family, friends, and sometimes the community he doesn't know. So that was Didi. One thing I've noticed about Didi, he was so competitive, and he was always competitive to me. When he did come to Melbourne, he said, let's go play volley. I'm the only one who hasn't played against him in volley. I made a promise to him, yes, we'll play volley until my back gets better. And then I said to him, there's no way you can beat me in volley. I'm the tallest in my family. I'm six foot four. All right. I'm the good looking one. Didi thinks she's the good looking one. I'm the good looking one. All right, just setting that one straight. So. Uh, he also wanted to play me in poker, and it was then I knew that uh, he started to, you know, play a game that he wasn't familiar. So we played poker, I took $200 off him that night, and he asked for it back. It was a Saturday night, he asked for the 200 bucks back. I said, no, I'm not giving it to you. Anyways, I don't know what I was, I think I went and got me another drink. Didi vanished. I was like, where is he gone? Like, go, you know, I sent Carissa to go look for him. Couldn't find Didi anyway. Go check outside as you're smoking. Couldn't find. That's wrong. Ah, here's it too. Here's the naughty one. 
Um, so, couldn't find Didi. So, I'm pretty sure there's only two places you'll find Didi if he just vanishes like that. It's in either in the Club Royals, or there's no Club Royals in Melbourne, you know, either, either Siva or Bingo. Sure enough, I messaged him, where are you? Because he's at Bingo. I think he sent me, like, he's just waiting in the line to go up. Then I said, oh, where's your money? He goes, oh, can you please transfer me some money? So he caught me off guard, transferred the money. And just adding on what Albie said, you know, Albie said something smart, got a hiding for it. He said something smart to me, all right? And he, uh, Didi knew that I was going to chase him and smash him. Totally smash him. All right, and this was in the O-Tower at Zelda. So what happened was he got cheeky, picked up the soccer ball and threw it at me. Hit me on the side of the face. I went from zero to 100 in one second. Chased him. There's a door, glass door. Uh, I chased him through the glass door. As he went through, he closed the um, glass door and I went to stop the glass door. It shattered, it cut my leg. So every time I look at my leg now, I blame this guy. <laughs> so anyways, Didi Jonathan Bessie, you know, I have the utmost respect for him. Love and gratitude for my little bro. He's taught me a lot, and he continues to teach me in his absence. I respect him for the person he was, and I know a lot of us have spoken about it. I respect him for being him, for staying true to his craft, no matter how much his brothers and his old man try to change his mind about it. But I respected him for that. I respected his wholesome. No matter what it is, he was always inclusive of everyone he loved everyone someone just mentioned it today his smile his smile speaks a thousand words if that smile catches you you know straight away you're in love with Didi all right if he smiles at you it can sometimes make your day delightful just seeing his fat smile and yes I always said he had a fat smile all right and the love the love he had for everyone um, the love he had for everyone, his family, his friends, especially my kids and my wife. I think he had a closer relationship to my wife, and I was the outcast. That's how I felt. Um, Didi had a lot of gratitude as well. Didi was always, always thankful in his own unique way, and I think a lot of us touched on it. <coughs> he showed his, own, his, his thanks in his own way, whether it was cooking for you, he cooked for us, I don't know, it was greasing up to us for some money, but he would sometimes ask to take my kids out. Uh, sometimes I'll loan him some money, and his way of being thankful, he would ask for more. All right, so he was never enough. You know, one thing I wanted to say about Didi was he did things big. He did everything big. He was sassy about it, and he was like he had a class about everything he did. Didi was street smart. Not many people knew that. You know, I've I seen that. Uh, he knew how to hustle when he needed something. He was smart and strong. Was always engaged with family and the community. Um, he was just always out there and just loved it. Um, he always made new friends if it was a breeze. For some of us, it's a bit hard. Oh. This, uh, th those are some of the traits, um, just some of few traits that I loved about Didi. Didi always joked around that he was the favourite. Today, I'm just going to put my, um, my pride down. Yes, he was mum's favourite. He was mum's favourite, his belly, right hand man, the brains, headache, flu, COVID, the list goes on. That, that was Didi to mum. All right. Didi was just, was, Didi was my migraine. Right. But the love for Didi was pure for mum and strong. That's one thing I'd say. As I conclude the speech, Didi always had a place in my heart, my wife and kids. I sometimes think, um, yeah, I sometimes think Didi and Sam and my kids had a stronger relationship than I did with Didi. Hang on, darling. Losing Didi, 
It feels like I've just lost a part of my soul. I'll reflect on our journey and we'll continue to do so until we meet again. One, th one thing I think people may think, um, Didi always thought he can trick me under the table. All right, so Didi, have a whiskey bottle ready for me. When I see you, I'll show you how to drink a whiskey bottle so you don't fall asleep. All right, just finishing up just a small passage from the Bible. It's um, 2 Timothy uh, chapter 4, verses 7 to 8. I fought the good fight. I finished the race. I've, I've kept the faith. Now there is in store for me the crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, will award me on that day. And not only me, but also all who have longed for his appearing. This isn't goodbye, bro, but I'll see you soon. Watch over my kids. Come for them. Come for them when it's too hard. Come for them when I'm too hard on them and when the world's too nasty. Come for them. No need to watch over me. But walk with me and join me in my race. Mom. 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 I love you. I miss you. Mom. Show the heavens your sassy ways and tell them I'll be there to party with you soon. I'll chat to you soon. Thank you. And there you are. The conclusion of our eulogies. Yeah, more or so. For Didi. But my ear said, I see you poor fire to fear you, Lord. Leola saw all I said, and that. Only as you see, let it take me on a maliu. If you want to know the true measure of how a person lives, then make sure to visit his or her funeral. Lang I tell you, Lord, I know the true measure of a person. I live I poor tangata yo mai. I pay I for tangata yo mai. I live a long long yo la to mol mau. Ole ne yafi yafi. Ma le va va ya tu le 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 ofi ole mau tala ne. A inga mau wo. That is the measure of Diri's life. Ma tel to nuvo. It is easy la unga le hotel ya tu lolo na. La unga le olo tiri. You have spoken well tonight. Uh, recounting, reminiscing on how you spend your time with tiri. The good things, the funny things. What makes her life a truly unique one. Ole upule ole eulogy. You from you, Kalyan, meaning good. And a good word. Tonight you have shared good words about the life of Didi. And I thank you. I thank you for that. It is a great comfort to the parents and the siblings and the family knowing despite the shortness of life in measure of how many years but it was a full life it was a full life what if after i did for the first time i've come to meet most of my cousins nephews and nieces so Didi's going home is actually bringing me 
to meet my family. Langwa ul tama tua. Alva nga leo sina maula o tangata pia. Vai pune o la ilato, sama sul solo, mamao. O la uye ina. So tonight it's a blessing for me as well. And I think that's one of the good thing about Didi's life. I'll be able to, to meet Fem. Hi Fem. <laughs> yeah. A later town on the Umar Sound now known as Upoletua. Late town. Langer Sound Ninga, Marsaminga Lolo Didi, or the Fafi Timer Tau Langa Iletua. Lona Winga La Tau Lunga. Oleal feta laio le tua. Ya te oe, ma le nepo. Le to la mona didi. Ale upo le tua neviaf, motato. We are still continuing to live. And we need that. As we grieve. Ya ono le malanga didi. Oleo la sumel sunga le oa ya. Leal el pule. Mataya. Ya. Awase upu fa ma fan fana mutato. Hello, folks. I'm going to go to the Fiafi. 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 I'm going to go to the Oi, ia tei tei mai roto soi fua mo so nei ola, e o tato fela e fia fia le nei tu la la fia fia. Pa fa tei fua le au au na, nei a fia fia tato no ia o la na sumo sa tato na tu la il pone, a wa se fe au mo le tu a ia pe tei e wa, o mo o fu e seven no nei tei a nei a fia fia, ia e fa ngai nei fua lo nei tei ngai tei o se a ve fe au mo le tu a, a va tu si na upu ma fa na fa na ina ia fa la e au wa yo fi na ngalo mo tato lo tu nei a fia fia. Mae la fionga pai o le atua, fe se la mota a vitu o le aso le nei, o le aso na fai e iova, tato te fia fia ma oli oli ai. This is the day that God has made for you and me to rejoice and be glad in his name. Alanga me so amini. Tato te le o mai tato te fano anoa. Te iona. So no year that to own a message for you, Mau. That to one may celebrate the life a did is I so a full more life. Till turn near Fiafi here or say Fiamu Tato. I want to bring you a message of hope. Our two or three hour Nepal. Hope. Just four words, four letters, sorry. H O P E. Hope. Bole fa moi moi, fa moi moi le le fe mai le apostolo le tu si Roma es full malua, fe mai ia e oli oli le fa moi moi, ono sa ile pua pua nga fina finau le talo, le nga te le fe mai tu si te talo dia, ma tu te le fa vai vai e pe fa no noi, po la tu ele ai so la tu fa moi moi. Fa moi moi le leo e suma nia fiafi. E fa moi moi ngai tasi tato te fa moi moi o le langi maleola e fa vau. Puno mai o te wao fa yes tato te talo. Lo ma tato te mai vi i lava lawa fio i nia fiafi. I lava no ma feo no ma tato moa ma tato te fa afonga ma faro mo longo ai. Pe si aro fina ngalo mo i ma tato i nia fiafi. Tu la ilo me fenga venga vai vai ma fa te wao. Eli lo se mea, fara mo la mo fa mo mo ya tu le mana lo wafio. Me fa yo na ulu ulu atu ilo fe au ilo atu fina ngalo mo atu fa mo mo. Ma tu la mo na ma fa na fa na oil ne ya fi afi. Pa ima ya ti ma tu fa fa ya su ilo fa fonga mo. Amen. Ole a mo esta tu ma o tu ele tu si le a o Filipi.
Don't know, she la see the mate woman. Or the tattoo of Maulia, or la mo my outdoor tattoo. A fair hour in here, fia, Philippe, a lua tattoo. Fit off at us, if I'm on Molly. A waro tattoo, no money. Amen. The English uh, speakers, can you just, just read it in English, please? When, when you came from Samoa, when you came to this country, you were a Samoan citizen. When I came from, I don't come from America. When I came from Samoa, I was a Samoan citizen. And then I come to New Zealand. Now I'm a New Zealand citizen, just like you. So, my citizenship is in heaven. Amen. You are only here for a, a temporary time. But your real home is in heaven. Fasili, where is our near? Where is our only oi? It's a fame alanga ilelangi. Or if they are Nepo, or if they are more oi, or did his friends and his families, and especially for myself. If they are only ilinea fiafi. Johannes, who far fay po more more little. What's that? Oh, Tino, yes, who? That's a fay table fay more more fam and more. I want to vale to loto. You to fa to to my atia. Let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God. Believe also in me. This is Jesus words. Ai pe lua. E tele me no no foi ile ma ota lo to ma. Ana le ai. O fa ya tu ya ti o to o te alo sa uni se me no no foi o to. A fa fo yo ti alo sa uni se me no no foi o to. O te toi sau. These are the words of hope. O upu nea le tua, Yesu. O le fa'a moe moenga lea. O te toi sau. O te alo sau ni se meno no foi tiri. No foi oi. Ma o. Ai o te toi sau. Ai sea. Ina ia fa'a tasi tatou. I le langi ma le holo le fa'a vau. ฟังเราเงาเลยว่าไฟปุ่ยลิมบัตรจอนเวลีอุ้มมีลาวสตาร์ทูฟีอาวิลเนียฟิอาฟินอสินาวฟังมาลอสเยตัวตัดตัวอ
Amen. Não, mas o Fá foi por vários sítios, tanto foi tão fácil, tanto foi muito bom. Tanto te olha, mole ali, te afai e oti. E oti, mole ali. Romans 14, verse 8. For if we live, we live to the Lord. And if we die, we die to the Lord. Therefore, whether we live or die, we are the Lord's. Amen. It's a full ma eola. It's a ola mole riti. It's a ola mole atua. O how many me te lo me faina e faia. Me le le o ma. O le temi ne fa tino ai. Ai nga ne afi afi. O le temi ne e fa tino e lo walofa e le ali. Amen. Why o fo temi te oti. It's a mali ma oti. It's a oti mole riti. Therefore, o ta to o ma. O le fa now. Aleatua. Amen. Fa solo tato. Fa ni ni afi afi. Ah, tato liu le. Luo timo teu le. Tolo fai pe mo mo. Tato fai tofa. Tasi fa mon mon. Aye lo o ni mea. Fa mai o aso e ngatai. E o o mai e aso fe ngatai. Ola so i loa i te minewa e so i fuoma uola. Ni aso file mu. Ni aso e tau lau li lia. Wa e ola ma uso i fuoma uola. E so i fuoma uola. I aso ma temi whenga ta. Ni fai mai ele. Le tingu te ulea. Fai mai ona aso e ngata hai. The last days. In the last days. Or the perilous days. Times will come. Rona winga. That uh, it's like a dangerous time that you're living at a risk. Just yesterday, one of my um, cousins, the Opinato Fa Fungai Foi, said to me, he was um, uh, shot into low lava. Le, my mother said to Ophia, so my father said, "Enga my dad to Ophia, I'm gonna leave you." He was shot in um, Pepatoi. Um, it tells you. You know, people are playing with lives like nothing. Well, well, my mother is not telling the average so full. Is the matter? I see. What that all my email? What that all yai? It tell me thing at all. What that all yai? It tell me fight or so fuanga. But I am mobile never know. I am mobile man never all. I am mobile my lossy my little tour. Or it tell me need to be nice. To be nice of in angalo. O oil to mama tina malofa now. Tapena tatu lasso tatu to fill up ye may so cute. For me, my tail and usufa, for me, a wire pay you no poor noa. If I pay na lasso, a few may let a little tangata. I poor noa, the yelfi hour noa. A langa no tangata, or may a foul of a. I see Ole aho o mai le lolo, lono winga wa ngata le fai unga pole pole unga la langi la formatia unga la langi alanga le onua o mai e fau le va. That was the message na yai temi na ono po onua. Piano tosi la fia na le tu a valu tangata na sao sao mai yai. I see, I say, I say na all la tangata yeah they lived their own lives. No, they cooked, they, they grew, they grew food, they built houses, they were doing their families, they lived normal lives, but they did not know there would be a, a time that would come. You live your normal life. But death is coming. Death is coming. Amen. I only met John Tato Faya. For my mother, she only has four women. Five brothers, four men. One. She Tato Faya Tau Fa Tasi Fa Mon Mon. Faya Tau.
Amen. Mate, for what profit is it to a man if he gains the whole world and lose his only soul? You can gain everything in this world. Money, fame, fortune, everything. I am a Amen. Yet he made the town that of fire. It's a town on a far more more a tour. Family, my tail, Leono, my potorum, my torsum, Ia mua isa ili le ma lole tua. Malana amio tonu. On a fa o popo. Me umma ya tio to. See, a lot of people they think, they say, if I'm a moral family. Alleluia. It's good. It's out. Ilele. But ile fina ngalo le tua. E mana o le tua. E fa mo mua ya. First. Prioritize. E mana o le tua. E te tano e fa mo mua ya. E me umma te faya. E si la fia le tua. O te mana o mia ni lava. To low lava. Ni lava lava. O te mana o mia se fale o te nofo ai. O te mana o mia me o te fa unha ina ina tau si lo a ina. Peita e fa mei le tua. Fa mei e su. Mua isa ili le ma lo le tua ona fa o popo inga ili o mea uma ya te utu. E ila uso le alala mai i. Sa ma sa nini ma lo tu. Tau sanga mo leva. O fea tu ila uso le o asi asi a tu ili si a fi a fi fea. Se a fe tu i sa wo i ta teo lo tu. O mea la uso e te a me. E le leilo lo wa inga. O laku lo loko. Leso. Faira na fale, faira na ta vale, faira na piscinis, me umma. O to ira tu lo usuro fe tu na lau a tu o mo me solo ta o lot. Fa me le fiona le tua, esa ili mo mo le tua. Everything else that you need in this life, God will prepare for you if you seek Christ first. Because it is our God that is more loved like. I ma umai voi lo no lo wola mo lo wola. I say I will eat it at a penango fee. We're not ready for it. To teach ya umai tato fee, I will nea fee a fee. Yohane, so so tasi fee po e tulo si tato fee tau fa tasi le maule fa mo mo. Can I hear amen? Tangate fa tua tua le tua. E we love it hoti. Ai hola. Tau tino Jesu. Tangate na te fa tua tua le tua. La foa ilo na hola le tua. Give everything to to the, to the Lord. Ina i ma fai ona fia fia me le tua ye. Fa me tangate le. E hui ona ina hoti. Ai hola. Lo no winga e ye le si. Life does not end here. No, there is life beyond the grave. Amen. O mea uma wei loa e faia yo lima. I nga faia ia ma lo ma losi. A waele aise nga nuenga. Po se ma fau fau. Po se loa. Po se poto ili tu nga mau. O lo o e alu watu i ai. Basically, o mea uma e te loa. Ma e si la fia. E te faia yo lima. O lima ia. Fa me i nga faia ma lo ma losi. Do it with your strength. I find it if I'm now living my toast, you know, I'm not to a fine marus. I don't tell you, tell the maulia. In your langa for the nanga, your langa for the little tap in the penanga, or the timing, 
Nati soi fumo wolai. Ole temine fa o ngai ro ma losi. Ta pinai nei oe ma. Ma ta ainga ile langi ma le olai fa fa. Awa e ol temie te e te hot te pete ma liwai. Fa ma ile se poto. Ele se ma fa fa ele se ngan wenga. E ma fa ele ma fa yona to fa ya se se ngan wenga. Wa o ma le te ole temine nei. While you are alive, this is the only time you and I have, amen, to make ourselves right with God. Make yourself ready with God. Amen. I mean, I solo tato. Fiao. Tato mamun mulin ni. A message of hope. Ole fiao ole fa mui mwenga. Famele peru is full fai po tosu fi tosu fi tu. Si tato fai tau fa ta si fa mun mun. Wow, to e titi, to e titi lava. O nao o mai lea o le mali o mai lo no inga. O to e titi a fio mai esu. E le fa tu wai. E le fa tu wai mai. Ai o ringa ringa te tau no ta fai ya. A o ta to i ai ni nei so i fuanga mai nei paneta. O le sao ni uni. Peona sao no ta to te tai ni tai ya. E le to ya nga mo tiri fi au lea. E lo te la ngona mai tiri fi au lea. Al fi au lea nei mo oe. Ma au. Ina ia lava sta to tapinanga. Si fa i uina le mau leo le ma tai o lima. Fa i pue fa. Fa mai amu ia e fa noa noa. Wa e fa ma fa no fa na ina i la tau. I a vea i la fionga pa ia le a tua nea fi afi. Fa ma fa na fa na eo fi na ngara ma ai o ta to lo to i nea fi afi. I le soa fa i e su. Amen. Asi ya mai se pati pati na mo la un no nea fi afi. Mana tu ala le la un no la fi afi le nei. O la un no ta yao. Le si si la un no to e fa i ta yao. Fe au le fe au le ta wa na un mal ta usang le nei o fa au nga. Le ta ta wa na un mal nga fe au le nei fi afi. Ya, tu es assis à Simé, les femmes sont molles. Les gens ont l'air de voir tout le monde. Et il y a le moment où le vidéo tribute. Oh, oui, c'est un vidéo tribute. Est-ce que c'est un vidéo? Oui, les femmes sont molles. Et je me suis dit, je vais vous faire un minute. Les femmes sont molles, c'est un mal. C'est un mal, c'est un mal. 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 C'est un mal.
But you already had water works. It's all right. <laughs> but I just want to thank each and every one of you for coming out tonight. It means a lot. But, you know, if Australia doesn't work out, I'll always be back. And, um, yeah, you just eat means a lot to me. And you just buy that. And, um, yeah, I'll keep a short answer for I don't want Hey, Jay, thank you for coming. Um, I don't... I do have friends at work, but like, I mean, they too much uh, galu, so I just invite <laughs> the first one. Mm. But, yeah, I'm mean, that honestly goes. Anyway, il fait la ouma, il y a mole, ou pour le fol, il y a mes fol, il y a ma fanfana, il y a ma fanfana, il y a ma 
Ja, og det bedste er nej, muligt muligt nej, ja, nej. Ja, så du siger, 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 så du Ya mor fasi nongo ne vya. Le tu alo mato tamaua tau nu mai le fa i unga ole. Sao ninga fa le a inga. Ya ole ateli e pele loto manga ngo se wofo. Ya o se uso se tuangane. Ya ile ne a inga. Mato fa fi taile le ie wa sao mato fa longo longo. Ya iona mori mau. Ai mai se fo i taimi o so i fua. O tala mata ngo fie o lona ola e fela nula nuai. Ua la ngona e lava le faa maa fan fanaina. E ui na o mata ula ngona foi. Le misia tele o ia. O na ua toe foi atu yo o ao. Ao la mata o titalo. Ia tuli tuli loa ina e loa nganga. O matua, o uso matua faafine. A inga mo uo. I le faa maa fan fananga la ua fio. Ia o na o mata o maa fati e pea. Ia ile malanga malauvala au ile atali nei. Ta tau malau o fio ile nei afiafi. O toe sao ninga fo i o fua fua ina ile aso mua mua. Ia la fo i atu i la o fio e te whaatau tai. I lou lava alo fatele. A ia i lungo i mātou uma. Lungo mātua ma ainga ma uo. O e o māwhatia le manuia malifi le muo la o fio le atua le tama. Le alo fasili sili eso i esu ke riso lo mātou ali faola. Le maafutanga malouwa nganga pa ia, ne ie oo ili faava vau, ili faava vau lava. Ameni. Ia wa tātou tau nuu maila, ali si ui ori tātou faa mwemoe, mo le tuel faa fatale siunga le tae taa ilo sauninga, ia faa pefo ili siunga le ia wao, saunia le afionga ali etua. Ia a ua saunia ai nganga lua se... Se vai malui i o le ho, o wale te lingo le sua i le so, ia, tala au atu iai, ma fio atu ma, i nga tatou te, tau mo fai nga, ia ma tatou te tano, ma se i o tatou eva, ia, ili tai tau le po, o se fa ali nga tu le, tau ni manui ali tatou o fiafi.
Let's go, 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 let's go